first game of the tournament, Penn State. They won last night, 60-51 against Minnesota. Liddell, top of the arc, and there you go. There's the first team all Big Ten player, E.J. Liddell. He'll pick it and brought Seth Lundy off some pin downs away. Got him an open three. He's been pretty good over the last five games. And Liddell short. Rob for Penn State to compete, stay in this ball game tonight wrong injury-wise for my ball club. This offense already depends on two guys so heavily. And they're both really good. That's a pro. <laughs> yes. I mean, that's just that's a pro play right there with EJ Liddell position. Uh, someone opened a door and Wheeler threw it to the other side, but look who's there. Tap back, Joey Brunk battling. Oh, what a ball finish. And bring himself up. Air burying his shoulder into the chest of Brunk and getting to that fadeaway. I talked about the pace at Penn State being so slow and deliberate as good. Joe gets another bucket. If you're Ohio State, they don't play there. They're a team that's going to win with their defense. The question is, can they make enough threes to hang in there tonight? Haven't made one yet. Liddell in and out. Branham Three. keeping it alive. That was all Malik. Things have changed since when you played in the no, 70s. I'm, okay. 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 I mean, technology has gone get, the other way. The bottom of this. <laughs> Liddell getting to the bottom of the net. He's got 10. Liddell. Size advantage on Pickett. Into the paint. Short. Can pins. EJ Liddell, 10 points to lead all scores. He's looking for 13. Branham, another offensive board. Pickett just didn't go get start the offense because he believes he's a good offensive player. Trying to really shoot it. Hasn't shot it great the last couple games, but that's why he's out there. That one just died on the back of the rim and goes down from the depth. Liddell, two-time first team all Big Ten. And that's why. Count the bucket, the foul as well, and that almost untouched to the basket right there. Liddell, short from deep. Ohio State six of. Liddell, mid range post, no. Up to Liddell, off his foot. They got to go. Contested in the corner. Dredd saves it. And he's pushed. Liddell up top. Cross court. Brown leads it. Liddell point blank range. In and out. Batted out of bounds by the run. Yeah, good, good check with Russell that had a big game up in Michigan that you can't allow to beat you. Liddell driving this time. Off the window. Down it and the foul. E.J. Let us in that time not use his body to pick up a foul on Devontae Jones. Liddell off balance and takes it down. See, he's a different player, Gus, when he makes it. And a crowd. Liddell with another rebound. E.J. rises. Rips it. Uh-oh, watch out. Be able to anchor him in. Either you swing the ball, come back to the strong side where he can make a play happen down low. Now Liddell backs down the freshman. Knocked away and taken away. Nicely done by Houston. But more patience by Diabate to allow Brooks to clear enough space to ultimately catch and then finish. Liddell, mid-range jumper on the baseline, rattles home. That's where he's going to earn his money. In that board is going to say, on the pick and roll, just go underneath. So Jones has given himself that little rhythm dribble that he can pull right up. Liddell. And Terrence Williams with the rebound. Shot clock at 19. Liddell. Started by Williams. Playing him toward the baseline. There is a double. Liddell gets it off. Big key with the rebound, but he's stripped. Devante jumps. Just to play post big in turn. Eight seconds to go. Branham. 75-69. The kick out. Liddell off the mark, knocked out of, saved from going out of bounds. In the season, guys are still getting called regularly for illegal screens. Brunk getting the start. Zed Key still out with the ankle injury. Mm. And EJ Liddell! 
Liddell. Here's Eugene Brown. Turns, knocks it down. And it looks like this was going to be one of them. <laughs> Hogard, his shot blocked. Here's EJ, open. Fire. From this group, that's been the problem. You, you know, I was going to say, generally during this time, Liddell rejected at the rim by Marble. And here comes the Spartan, Hogard. Here's Wheeler. That's a tough matchup. EJ finally misses. And here comes Gabe Brown. And you see Michigan State's going to sag off of Brown. Here's Liddell. He'll pull up. And knock it down. in that first half, but that second unit came in and then Gabe Brown got hot and they got right back in it. Here's Liddell. Oh, man. Forces that one in. You got to capitalize on that because that's who Michigan State is. They run the floor and they punish you if you don't run with them, and that might be a good way to really get back at Joey Brunk being on the floor is push it. North, man. It was great being back there. Special stuff, man. Absolutely. It's really special stuff. Love it. Love Westerville North. I live in my hometown, so I'm old news. <laughs> <laughs> they don't care anymore. It's, they see me at the club. Part of it's just accepting the role. Here's Liddell. Working on Hall. Puts the shoulder into it. Loose ball. Christie comes. Here's Liddell. With five. Forces it up and got it. To maybe adjust to what's happening in the game, but the reality is Ohio State just played well, they made shots, and they did so with a depleted roster. Liddell had the capital. A tough loss, really just struggled on the offensive end of the floor, couldn't get going, and then Maryland got hot. EJ Liddell, a guy who can get hot missing his first shot, stays on this end. And that's one thing Chris Holman has talked about. Offensively, when the ball moves, we are much better. When it gets stagnant, we don't share the basketball. It makes it really difficult. So the first two shots for the All-American EJ Ledeer today in shoot around. Really want to find a way to attack those gaps. Malachi Branham off the mark, but Liddell, offensive rebound, and everybody sinks off of him, but he misses the mid-range jumper. Steph, we're kind of seeing the difference in tempo. Nebraska wants to go fast. And Oh, Liddell taps it back in. But Ohio State, their tempo is down around 279th in the country. <laughs> Wiltshire over 40%, his team best 48th triple of the season. Liddell looking for the equalizer, and he's got it. And Liddell hitting that one early. He struggled at Maryland, missed all five of his shots from outside. Here he is, 17-footer, yes. <laughs> There's that versatility. Yeah, it sure is. And, and you mentioned tempo. Up and down the floor are affected. So going deeper into his bench early here. Going deep in the shot clock. Liddell just hoists it up. Offensive rebound, and Brown lays it back. Great pass by Verge. Andre able to get it and convert. Well, he averages three points a game, but his first bucket there. Now Liddell off the mark. Great response here. Unchecked. Gets the dunk to give him 14 points. Now Liddell on the other end, driving. Can't get it off the window. And a rebound comes down to Mayan. They win at Penn State. And they have controlled things here. Five to shoot. Liddell, desperation, missing it at the end of the shot clock. A lot of pounding going on in the half court. Liddell, stop and start in the lane. Yes, he's got 20. The straight look. Webster misses, but boy, they're getting some wide open shots. That's what happens on that triple punch. And the crowd was ready to explode, but Liddell short. Ability to knock it down from deep. The Arizona State transfer scored 14 points a game for the Sun Devils. Into the shot clock here behind the back from Sotos, but Liddell misses. And then off. 
Here's Liddell. He's been the leader. 25 points. Looking for two more. No. Partially rejected by Mayen. Fur over and back. Now he gets it. Uh, the air balls are three. Liddell is there. Powers it up and in. Barnes getting it off to Liddell, guarded by Walker. He'll pull from three, off the mark, rebound to Bryce McGowan's and race in the Big Ten, led by fifth-year coach Chris Holtman, who is two wins away from another 20-win season. It was 8-0 Maryland to start, but the Buckeyes made a couple substitutions. They brought in Arms, they brought in Young, and they're within three. And they'll stay right there. And the Georgetown transfer, Wahab, back to that zone. And sometimes your rebounding responsibilities get a little fouled up when you're playing zone. Brown has missed all three. Liddell for three. Rebound chased by Eric Allen. Looking in, can't get it. And Liddell from Belleville, Illinois, the other way. Launches for the three. With the rebound for out inside by Ian Martinez. Across. Finds Liddell. Eight and a half to play in the first half. Nice fade away by E.J. Liddell. And Lottie, it was almost a post-up move while he was driving. Liddell, three. Rebound, Ayala. This is the kind of performance that they're looking for. Wisconsin, the top four teams get the double bye in the upcoming Big Ten tournament. All on the road to the final four. Liddell, three. Ayala, the rebound, poked away by Wheeler, and Ayala got a balance and out there on the wing against Hart. Liddell, he'll work inside on Scott. He just has that ability, Kevin, to see a little bit of space. Yeah. Liddell has been fairly quiet. Taking him into the paint, across the lane, held. Always in a street jacket, and he can't get it. Grabs his own miss. And Frenham with us. Championship team. This crowd was fired up before the game, and the, the energy just carried over to the Maryland team. Their defense set the tone. And then he fats Russ. This game against Michigan State, but as you see, Kevin, no lack of confidence on that jump shot. Now 0 for 7 from 3 over the last two games as Liddell misses his first jumper and navigating up, jumping out early on the Buckeyes. Here's Liddell. Crowd reacting to the Illinois native playing for Ohio State every time he touches the ball. Luke Goody with a See if they can get something positive on the offensive end and Liddell on his favorite block. Up and against Goody. Left out on a little short, the rebound to Omar Payne. Right, we got good shots, and that's where if you're Chris Hain, Kofi Coburn back on the floor. Buckeyes just trying to get this guy going. Liddell 0 for 3 to start tonight. Tough shot, and he makes it look easy. easy. Right and he went right back into traffic. And I'm working against Curbelo, a flop warning issued. Liddell will launch from deep, mm. and he'll answer from 3. Easy. Now they'll stop it. With the flop warning, or seven in the first half alone. Oh, home sweet home. Okay, mm. that's what that is. Liddell back and down. Turn around for Liddell. Kurt Beller with a rebound, looking to play through Hawkins. Jump stop in the paint. Are they going to count the bucket? They are. It's a goaltend and a foul. And, you know, and uh, EJ got kind of to a spot, Liddell, but you got to be able to have from behind the heart. Three to Liddell. The turnaround for Liddell is good. He started to find his rhythm good. He started to find his rhythm midway through that first half. But a smart play. Instead of trying the weak side to get a block from behind, he may not be the initial defender, but he cleans up the mess around the rim, and now he's able to come back and get to a sweet spot. And a timeout. Taken in a baseline. And the tip there for Young. Activity. That time, because Liddell spent to the baseline, that got Coburn down just a little deeper in the paint. He's in the play against guys who are a little bit bigger and stronger. Liddell, five on the shot clock. That three won't go, so they get the stop after the Curbelo three. Wheeler backs out to Young. Entry Liddell, eight to shoot. Can't connect. Out of bounds, Illinois ball. That your team can get you back into position. 
in this game. Liddell, traffic cleared a little bit for Bella with his head on a swivel Smart. as Liddell turns and hits the jumper. Well, that's the second. E.J. Liddell with nine to shoot, working against Coburn. Good help that time by Hawkins. Oh, fade away for Liddell. It won't go, and the rebound took a second bounce and a foul on the... Liddell attacking Hawkins, who has four fouls. Oh, what a tough fadeaway. Big-time shot for a big-time player. Oh, especially with Rob Finnessy hitting jump shots. This is a different Indiana offense. Liddell, and his first shot off the mark. Zed Key trying to get it on the offensive glass. Can't tap it back. Got that consistent third player is what they're, you know, searching for, you know, your Ohio State. But Liddell is the man. He's missed his first two three-pointers. He can hit that, though. He's a Rick Russell. Gives it up to Liddell. Liddell so far hasn't scored. 0 of 2. Try to change that, and he does. A little bit of space. So again, Ohio State, they last time, last six shots they put up, they've gone down. Liddell trying to make it seven in a row. Has it stripped, but it'll stay on this end. Seven to shoot. And seven points. Gets his bucket there. To give him five. Liddell will try to even it, and he's off the mark. Liddell, one of five so far for the All-American. And he wants to go to work here. Great defense by Geronimo. He's so athletic. But two plays. He played him well. He absorbed the Connie with it, got inside, and now with the balls began in Trace Jackson Davis' hand, it ended up in his hands again for two and top. Liddell for the And E.J. Liddell hits the triple. Is with young men that despite being a great shooter, you just can't find his rhythm right now. And inside, E.J. Liddell finds himself wide open. And some teams have been leaving him open, and he said all year, I'm going to take it if I'm wide open, and he did there. Now on the defensive end, Liddell, pretty hook shot. He just elevated over there. Get you a basket or get fouled and get you the free throw line. Jamari Wheeler in the paint, pivots up top. Liddell lines it up and Ooh. throws it right out of bounds. A rare air ball. He is a high volume scorer. Still sitting on nine points. Trying to change that tough shot off the mark. Good help that time by Xavier Johnson, kind of stunning hand to. Ohio State needs one in a bad, bad way. They go to Liddell, and he's rejected by Thompson. Indiana with a run out. Bates rejected on the... For Tamar Bates. Liddell driving, stopping, missing. Flying through, though, Kyle Young. That was just an effort play for the senior. Branham driving on Stewart. Gets to the baseline. Finds Liddell. With Wheeler coming in, maybe it goes to a Buckeye player for a layup. Only five on the shot clock here. Liddell, fadeaway jumper, tough shot. E.J. Liddell, the All-American. Now Liddell backs his way down, draws a double team, rises off the front rim. No, loose ball, batted around, picked up by the Hawkeye. Not just a young man's basketball ability, but who he is as a person. I said, this is a no-brainer. Inside, Liddell, mm. nice look. Paint touches for Ohio State, so critical. Some paint touches and some points inside. And now that takes some stress off the offense. You'll always have to be as accurate from behind the line. Nice position, Liddell. Ohio State has made their life. And he'll bring it up the floor. Liddell, great position. Power dribble, 10. Liddell, time to eat. Baseline turn, way short. Yeah, but that's the shot counter from the university for those two men. Here's Liddell, guarded by Murray. Great matchup. Oh, Pull yeah. up jumper, <clears throat> off the front rim. Branham trying to keep it alive and out of the pack. Four to shoot. Liddell has to hurry, elevates. Oh, he knocks it down. 
as the shot clock expired. It wasn't the Nebraska game where he had 35. He said it was uh, Penn State before that. Brandon set the Ohio State cross record with 35 versus Nebraska last week. With Liddell. Brandon. Liddell with a look off the mark. Three point attempts per game. Liddell takes it himself. Blocked by Keegan Murray. What the penalty? Now Liddell. Triple team. Mm -hmm. Taken away. Chris Murray. Liddell starting to force things now. Cedric Russell. That perimeter defense has been tough. Liddell. Mm -hmm. yeah. Take that. Just because of the hustle of the Hawkeyes. 71-62. Liddell. Bully ball. No. Eulis plucks it up. On the base finds Jamari Wheeler for the open three and an offensive rebound for Liddell. Well, Kevin, rebounding was a problem for Minnesota in this first matchup. Ohio State just crushed them on the offensive glass and they're going to work early. Get him a foul on the floor before he goes up and initiates the contact. There's Liddell. No problem after the elbow in the jaw. Liddell gives the Buckeyes the lead. Liddell, jump stop inside for two more. Just too strong. I mean, that's just his body. Well, Russell almost picked up that pivot. Dump down to Liddell. Against Battle. Had room on the baseline, just short. Well, the last time these two teams met, you know, Ohio State had their way with him. And, and oftentimes, you get in your mind that it's going to be the same way the second time around, and it just isn't, isn't going to happen. Organized to five. Two to shoot, one to shoot for Liddell, and you every inch of that rim to get point. Here's Arns, off the shot fake, into Liddell, had good position, and you see the result, he's got eight. Yeah, he's gonna get himself going, now you gotta get him the basketball. You know, that has been working, and, and it doesn't work if you switch passively. It doesn't work if you don't have a hand up to contest shots. You hear coaches all the time talk about high hand, high hand. If you put that hand down on Peyton Wilson. Those eight are in this building. Yes. Good news if you're an Ohio State fan. All <laughs> right. <laughs> Liddell for three. And he rattles it home over Daniels. Another area of his game as we've seen over the years. Adding something. Can he be as he launches and hits again? Is he making his case in this second half for continued combat? Off the fake. Three to shoot. Russell with two to shoot. One to shoot. Liddell has to force it up. Can't get it to go. And the rebound for Sutherland. Drive by Eli Brooks on the screen for the screen. And then you get tickets into the left hand. If you're Juwan Howard, you will take that all night. Here's EJ Liddell for three. That's no good. Ohio State, one of the top efficient enough dunks. What do you think of Ohio State's pick and roll defense? Well, it, it's, it's better play well tonight. Otherwise, look like Purdue. Purdue really struggled, and when you need a bucket, that's your guy. E.J. Liddell getting the whole suck from three. All right, that was quite the catch from Dickinson, and maybe an even better pass. He sees the floor as well as any big. Diabate got the hand in. It's going to be a matchup to watch. Can the front on Thursday night against Purdue? He just loves his mentality. I mean, he came out aggressive, assertive, and playing with a ton of energy. Liddell misses the jumper. That sort of jumper will be key tonight. Michigan has really struggled. Ohio State as well. They've kind of got more into a groove and more comfortable. It's, it's been a different story. It's really good defense by Brandon Jones. Making that into a contested shot for E.J. Liddell. Now no direct traffic. Screen for Young. Into the post. E.J. Liddell with his full toolbox for two and a foul. Liddell, written hard by Diabate. Measuring him. Liddell scores that again. You talk about his understanding of what he. E.J. Liddell, the spin. Oh, oh wow. window. 
Nice. Big time. That's well defended, by, but he's so important to the Buckeyes. His engine is nonstop. Liddell and Dickinson together again, and the leaner scores. He's just so strong. I mean, Hunter Dickinson I Brooks on my team every day of the week. He, he is a winner. I don't know that Liddell and Wheeler knew the play there. They were talking at the top, this and Liddell play. says, give me the three. <laughs> yeah. Big hit for Kyle Young. Hey, and the finish with the right hand, so impressive. He had a little Xavier Simpson hook shot yeah, in that pocket. Seriously. Didn't? Liddell over Dickinson. No, Young always involved, but he couldn't pry it away. Gets an elbow for his trouble and saves the possession to Russell. Well, he wanted that shot again. Instead, he turns to Liddell and the rebound for Jones. It's what the freshman can do. He, he can really get to the rim. Liddell wants Diabate. It's Diabate, three fouls. Just about contesting, just like that. You, you didn't block his shot, but you made it tough. DJ Liddell against Diabate. Body to body, Liddell tunneling in, can't find the shot, now he does, and scores! Jawan Howard wants a three set. from three on the year. That's, he's in there to get to the basket, but in that situation off the post double, that's where you want Caleb Houston in that corner taking that shot. Liddell missed the three, Brooks collects the rim. Liddell and Williams. E.J. Liddell parks himself near the lane, feeling him out. Liddell spinning, firing, and scoring! That shoulder is so good. Zed Key has four, Diabate with four, Dickinson with three as we hit the stretch run. Into the corner it goes, and a three for EJ. Warming against Michigan State. Making plays on the ball, making it chaotic. This time going a little zone. EJ Liddell getting a good shot from the high post, but unable to get it to go. Harper, deep three up top. Here at Jersey Mike's Arena. Wheeler's pass once again finds Liddell, shoots over Mulcahy, it'll count and one. He can just, here's Liddell, now matched up against Harper. As the back came down in the paint, fades away, blocked. Mulcahy, it's going to be an open three, but Geo Baker playing that passing lane. What guys have missed, as you see on their last seven from the field. But Liddell changes that. Liddell. He has six. Only a talk before his feet hit the ground. Three to shoot for Branham. His pass tip. It's going to be Liddell up top. No. And Young could not hang on to it. And here comes McConnell. Yeah, Liddell skipping it. You give up a shot like that, you might not get a better one. A rare two from Arns. No, another put back there. And this one for Liddell on the seventh offensive rebound for the bucket. Liddell with eight. Baker the only one in double figures so far tonight. You know, Baker with 11 from Liddell. Answer, and he will quickly match him as that three goes down for E.J. Liddell. Late clock here for Key. Liddell wants it with three, with two, up and no, and McConnell the rebound. E.J. Liddell, I just think when you got... Liddell sets the screen for Wheeler. Young to Liddell against Reber with McConnell there. Count and a foul. Patience and execution. Random met by Harper. There's Liddell. Fades outside the paint. EJ Liddell with 16. Brandon with 19. He just knocks high from the field. Liddell against McConnell. Tough fade away. Short key right there with three to shoot and misses in. That guy's in no hurry here. Down with five to shoot, open space, too strong. He got a good one. Two defenders. What was that? To Branham. And the Buckeyes now break the pressure. Liddell to Key underneath, has it blocked. But there's Liddell cleaning it up. No. Liddell got it back again and kicks it back out to Wheeler. Steadying influence. Graduate transfer from Penn State dealing with turf toe. Kick out. Liddell. That range is impressive this season, but he comes up short on that long three ball. Once in a while, he just, he just can't buy one. Ohio State trying to push in transition. And Liddell just took over. Discard and a dunk. E.J. Liddell throws it down. Jump right at his look as well. A lot of dribbling here from Wheeler. Now they'll get into a set with a screen from Johnson. Oh, yes.
work it around Liddell. Liddell for Wheeler. And his own saves bodies too. I think that's why they're going to it as well. That's too easy. Liddell, short corner. He finds a little sweet spot on the Johnson gets into it quickly. Liddell looks inside. Keep it on the perimeter. Nice cut by Liddell again. Oh, great field. Right into Liddell, who banks it home. Oh, that's a great read. He came up with a lot of speed, don't they? And a blow up taking a bye because that little one by Wheeler. Well, it's just a, a next gear. No question. Long rebound, Ayala. Get it ahead, Scott, and he didn't catch it. Unforced error by Maryland. And Lattell makes him pay with a floater and the foul. That's that handle we talked about earlier. Confident in the push. Scott missed it short. And Branham with a tough rebound. And you got to turn him to the other way, Branham. Liddell ready. He knew he missed it. He oh. the drop step didn't work initially, so he circles again. You're up, you're up. Baseline delivery. Push shot. No. Branham. Liddell. Rebound. Again, relentless on the inside, Eastley. And the lead is 14. Kids are so good with that drag dribble. Separation here by Liddell. Felony. Liddell knocks it down. 9.55. Maryland has made five of its last six attempts. Liddell, pull up. Oh, does it go? On the glass. There is somebody on the glass. And it's Keith. Trying to load up. Guys in no rush. Nice high-low. How pretty is that? Young to Liddell. Layup goes and a foul. Liddell with a chance at a three-point play. And that would have made it nine. Instead, Ohio State is in front 74-62. Liddell, open look. He cans it. No cover whatsoever. Scott this high-low set now. I like him in this ISO here. We've got a clear for him. Settles. Liddell elevates. Three-pointer, no. Asking for contact again. No whistle. He may... Liddell trying to bury Gillis. He's got him. Liddell, good post. Has the step and puts it down off glass. He's got to take advantage of that situation. These two teams met three times last year. He's got to bounce and, and go out jump him. Liddell, shot clock down to five, and he hits. Nice read. Big fella. Drag the big away, and they can do like even here. Opens up a drive. Liddell into the corner, gets it back underneath. Point blank, missed it. Young is there. Good offensive rebound. It really reads things beautifully. But Liddell's got to reseal, repost. Where he steps out. Liddell, the fake fires. Front rim missed it. A good box out by Gillis. Young, so active. Three and change left before halftime. Here's Branham. Now to Liddell. He's going to fire. That's a deep three short. And yeah. Ohio State can't shoot straight from deep. He doesn't have the lit. Jamari Wheeler making his return from that one game injury absence. Nice cut. Liddell finds his spot. Track though, right? Gee, even on the deep one. Six to shoot. Six to shoot. Johnson gets it back from Young, weaves his way in traffic underneath. What a pass. Johnson underneath, and Liddell wasn't even close. Intimidation. What a crazy thing in the deflating thing right now for Ohio State, as Purdue has done this without Ivy. Oh, it's been on the bench. Liddell. But they desperately need Liddell to start getting going. Uh, he had the little decade. Keep the dribble alive. Run him out to Liddell. They desperately need that. A little bit too much. Back of the rim. Fight for the rebound. I and mean, will it be Liddell? Their leading scorer, third in the Big Ten. At nearly 20 per game. Puts it in the deck to the wreck, and he puts it down. Well, Martin had done a nice job helping out a little bit with Liddell. More. They don't pack it. This guy gets the most out of his players, no matter where he is coached. Liddell trying to create some space. Tough go. basket over Gillis. And just the unlikely. Here's Wheeler back from his one game absence. Tough bounce skipping to Liddell. Good and Gillis clears. Seal it. Keeper. Jamari Wheeler, not a young. Whose number do they call here? Liddell. Why not? Jump stop. Floater puts it down. And here comes Ohio State. Quick attack. Here's Brown. 
He's been the catalyst into the corner. Liddell open three splash. What a beautiful play. Little back screen. Gets Liddell into the corner. On the floor, too. Stefanovic is pass. It's stolen. Young. Ohio State can tie Liddell. And he buries it. We are tied. Talk about you there. Welcome back, Michi Johnson, the freshman. Gets the start. You know, he's missed the last three games with a concussion as Liddell misses that three. In fact, with Branham and Johnson. They have the ability to feel out the game, pick their spots, and Ohio State's going to have to operate a little bit more and rely heavily on this guy, E.J. Yeah, Liddell. Liddell with the putback. That's one of the move the basketball, but they don't really give you anything threatening. And that's the thing. It's, it's a safe defense that is not disruptive other than the fact that it forces you to take tough shots. Liddell got his own miss. Russell inside to Liddell. Turn, fades, it's short. Mm. Branham the board. And Russell again from them pulls up, it's short. Liddell the board. The kick back to Branham. Good look. Drops a dime and it's blocked by Thompson. Here for Ohio State. One point lead for Minnesota. About five to play until the half. In and out for Branham. Liddell yeah. the follow. This is going to be the challenge with the zone. They, they have given up a lot of lead for the Golden Gophers. Trump. And Liddell knocks down the three. I got still there at Penn State. Two guys, I, I will always say, they are Penn State guys. You can build around those guys. Inside to Liddell, and he lays it in. It's Good. tough for a kid like that, man. You, you, you play every game you're wow. This matches the largest lead for the Buckeyes. Inside to Liddell. Ball fake. Counted and one. Let me go back to the ball fake. Open this game. Michi Johnson, no, there's Liddell. Another offensive board yeah. and a follow-up. You gotta figure it out, and if you're gonna play zone, you have to fight. Liddell, got it, the triple. Man, makes you better as a person. I, I think those are little things that are invaluable to a program and to a, an eventual franchise. They go right inside to Easy e the fall away. No good. You know. Their body language tells you everything. Kyle Young didn't give you any bad body language. They certainly missed him in the tournament last year. Oh, yeah. Oh, Liddell all alone. 20. Minnesota fans should should be showing up. It's they a good a, team. They have a lot to be. They're a good team, but it's the direction. It's become a dunk fest for E.J. Lur. And Branham fires off the back iron. Liddell open for three. Trano. And a 7-0 start for Ohio Singer. And has again really helped give Ohio State more depth at the five. Liddell top side. Just short. And the rebound to McClure of IUPUI. But for me, it's just been great to stay connected to the game and um, to do that in the Big Ten Conference, a conference that I grew up watching and dreamed of playing in, uh, just, just very special for me. Loose ball. I think they're trying to feel it out as opposed to running their stuff with assertive, with assertiveness. That was assertive. E.J. Liddell. Well, he, he did a great job of just surveying the floors. Joey Brunk kept the pivot foot down but missed the layup. E.J. Liddell for two. I think Brunk should get an assist just for all the work he put in there. Brought in a lot of guys from the transfer portal with experience, but no experience playing together. And it's year one of a rebuild for the IUPUI program out of the Horizon League. There's Liddell, who Young thought about it. On the cut, E.J. Liddell. Off the right side of the rim. And Azariah Say has the rebound. Greg Lee's a guy hasn't taken a lot of threes this year. He's a career 29% three-point shooter, but he's confident. This guy is ultra confident in E.J. Liddell. He's feeling comfortable early from outside, obviously, for Lee. So eight to four. Again, they'll review that to see if they need to adjust it to nine. And Liddell short. 
And last Sunday here against Northwest. That cat gets one to go down. Look out. I was on the call in Lincoln for his 35-point performance. They need his score. And Liddell ties us up at 10, so a 6-0 run right now. The oldest teams in the country. And I think that's allowed them to stay the course, improve, because older players don't kind of ride the wave. Great high-low action there. Kyle Young finding Liddell. Conference player of the year. Scored over 1,000 points. Yeah, and he had 23 the first time these two teams met on December 5th. An air ball there. Liddell comes right back into the game for Brunk in mid-2-3 zone. Talked about them switching up defenses. Little lob up top, Young for Liddell. And he missed it. One final opportunity from midcourt. Which created the skip pass three, so a good job by Hare at a post. The Penn State just 2 of 12 from outside the arc. They came in at 35% this season. Liddell missing key, clean it up again. It blocked, but he's wide open. He's got to shoot those with confidence. Liddell on the other end, foul, count it. He is the first player in double figures. He's got 11, and it'll be going for 12. But then the Buckeyes went on an 8 0 run, and they've sort of been in the driver's seat ever since. Good switch out. Hera stayed inside and passed out Tal Young. Liddell, he's really perfected that mid range jump match by Greg Lee. This crowd starting to groan a little bit here. Ohio State hasn't had a field goal in almost four minutes. Liddell changes it right there. I I'm not to switch out. This is a tougher matchup. Probably a face-up jumper or a drive. Liddell in the paint, fading. No. Rebound and a strong one for Greg Lee. Good job by Jamari Weller. Regresando con Liddell. Tiro. Y lo consigue. Fue Wheeler. Kyle Young. Se la deja. Young. Se la deja Wheeler. Regresan. Ahí está el duelo que ellos querían. El tiro un poco corto de EJ. Pérdidas. Ahí está el tema para Wisconsin. Los de negro son los Buckeyes. Y vuelven a errar en un tiro. El rebote que no puede controlar Eugene Brown. La oportunidad a Wisconsin. Ohio State. Ah, oh, si la encestaba, era la menor distancia en un buen rato. Hubiera sido a... Wheeler. No se la devuelven. Está solo Wheeler. Leidel. Y falló en el tiro. Se van al de puntos. En 18 minutos, el que más ha estado ahí en la cancha. Y Jay Ledeo. Y esto es lo que necesitaban. Ofensiva y puntos rápidos. Feller. Regresa la, la quería Wheeler, que estaba para el, listo para el de tres. Prefirió hacer la de dos. Muy bien, Branham. He hecho también el trabajo del otro lado de la duela. Y en la pintura. Gran vuelta, tiro y. Y Ledeo. Y Jay, la estrella del equipo. Wheeler, amplió el tiro y finalmente, finalmente. Regresó Wheeler. Wheeler. Y ese fue Lidell. Oh, la personal, Lidell. Puede acercarse a siete. Y la, la, la posición fue clara para evitar la, los pasos y el baile que le dio. Uh. Y el Idel se le quedó abajo ese balón. A pretty wide open lob, you've got to finish it. And the Nance playing in his home state has to hit that three. Yeah, he's from Akron. And there is EJ Liddell. You know, we talked about Brandon, but ultimately Liddell is the All-American. Northwestern 8-4. They lost Wednesday against Penn State after leading by 10 late. As Liddell, he's extended that range this year. He knocks down a three. Dave. It's Branham, the talented freshman, out to Liddell. The young and the old working together. Ten's assist leader. That's a 
Early blow for Northwestern with him on the bench. Liddell again from deep, and boy, is he feeling it already. 11 points. Yeah, they're young, more of a true center, more physical, can rebound, and Nance can play that natural four position. Liddell again. Oh, oh boy, folks. I think you better get ready for a show. E.J. Liddell. 16. He wants it up top. They didn't give it to him. Here we go. He's going to shoot it. And why would you not? Why would you not? They better guard him. And Bowie's got five points now in the five minutes he has played. Wheeler spins and gives it to Liddell. His oh, first oh, miss from outside the arc tonight. Well, a huge mistake. Barry, who started all 13 this year after coming off, coming off the bench every game last season as a freshman. Liddell, tough shot, but why not? Right over Nance. Well, that was... Liddell trying to draw the contact. No whistle. Out of bounds. That was pretty good defense there by Elijah Williams. Outstanding. De That's what Chris Collins has chosen to do. Young went for the steal, then a lot of contact. The ball ends up going over the top of the goal as the whistle came in. There's no foul, by the way. They say that just went off of Northwestern. Shot clock dwindling. Liddell knows it. Hits the tough fadeaway over Williams. At 1.5 is out of this world. Well, here's Liddell matched up with Robbie Barron. Here comes the double team. They forced that one up and missed it. Uh, Dees tried to save it, but he could. Jamari Wheeler, who had four steals in the first half, right now gets it right in there to Liddell. They fell asleep, but he lays it up and in. Now Liddell with a hand in his face. Offensive rebound, though. They have lost to ranked opponents. Chance tonight against the number 13 Buckeyes, but down nine. Liddell missing to make it 11. The Big Ten game can't be closed quickly, especially with that three-point line. And bucket and a foul. Tough take by E.J. Liddell. He's knocked it loose. Now Liddell goes to work. Yes! Well, that's what happens when you knock down from a career high. Might it be on this possession? Yes, 30, new career high, E.J. Liddell. And Barron got a hand on it, now Liddell looks up at the shot clock, lets it fly. And a foul is going to go against Ohio State. It's Liddell. Don't let Branham come around the corner and catch this. Barron. Oh, did they get the foul? No. Liddell missed it. Knocked out. And it belongs to Northwestern, but they're going to go into some traffic up top as they get it on the wing. Oh, Tops of Liddell, who averages up. nearly 29. Got to play him. Here's Liddell for three. Now, this is where I think Trace Dave. That is. Good passer, good screener, good cutter, young. Liddell fades, and too strong. Into the hands of Miller Cop. A three. Look up the career of Jim Jackson, learn all about him, do some research before he asked permission for it, and our very own Jim Jackson was kind enough to oblige. A oh, good oh, bucket there cool. as Liddell caught it midair and put it through. Yeah, nice job. Once again, the Davis was trying to keep it alive. Davis with a great pass to set that up. Sort of a hockey pass. Liddell's three doesn't fall. Liddell with the rebound. Nice slip. Oh. Pretty easy, too. Great read. Indiana by were, one. See if they go with two for one. This is a nice little iso. Nice pump, pump. Swatted away the second tonight for Jackson Davis with some authority for the Hoosiers. We have 14 different lead changes in the first half. The head of Steam Wheeler puts on the brakes. They kick it up top. And there is a triple from straight away where well, they needed that. Wheeler circles back. And kicks up top. Liddell lets it fly from the rim. And he follows his miss. They kick it out to Brick on one side of the back screen. Pop. 
Trying to find a way to get Liddell going. One of the conference's top scorers. He backs down, and a third block tonight for Jackson Davis. Yeah, nice collect. He doesn't get any tickets for speeding, I guess. He's trying to get some guys to move around. Inside of Liddell, and he can't put it through. Good defense right there by Thompson. With the attention, the step up by the defender. Nice little tough off. Liddell trying to get something going, and it's not even close. Boy, you can see the frustration on E.J. Liddell. Right back in his hands. Liddell, not close. Tough night for one of the conference's top. Inside look key again. Zed Key too strong. The man cleans up the rebound. Tominaga fires away for more percent from beyond the arc for Mayen this year. Branham. And now Liddell, corner three. Too strong. Wheeler pulls down the offensive rebound. Second opportunity counts when he does that as well. Double double his last time out against Kennesaw State. Nice follow by Liddell. Again, Fred Hoiberg talked about the rebounding. 573 yards passing, six touchdowns. That's not even the whole story. Jackson Smith in Jigba, three touchdowns, 300. Rebounding is going to be vital out of this zone. No reset on the shot clock. We Job by Walker denying that post up. Back out Liddell for three. Brandon, the only guy who's knocking down threes so far. Only two other walk on Arns. Four to shoot. E.G. Johnson feeds Liddell. Chance here for the Huskers. And Black Man. Switch it back up to Man on him. Isolated. E.J. Liddell inside the paint. Chris Holton wouldn't foul to score over the big fellas in the lane. Liddell for three. E.J. Liddell finally knocks down a big outside shot. And right with Ohio State back to a five-point lead. Liddell from the elbow. Webster flies in for the weak side rebound. Liddell just hasn't had his feet under ice. Bobbling shots on that little hammer play. And not getting a three up. Liddell into the hands of Wilcher, and there's Wheeler to rip it right out of his hands. Zesh yes. Nebraska, too, with that reset. And a de facto timeout for Ohio State to draw something up. There's Liddell, top of the key. Hasn't been his day shooting the basketball. Had a really tough time, Jeff, for those mid range in down here. Man, he's doing a great job at EJ Liddell all night. There's Liddell for three. Tapped out into the hands of Mayer. Wheeler's tighter. Same exact play. Now Walker's on him. Liddell turn around short. Tough night continues on his shooting from the outside. Given him guarding one of the elite offensive players in this league so far through one possession, so good contesting that jumper. Here's Liddell's first try, and it goes down a deep three for EJ Liddell. Center. Crowell trying to answer, left it short, one and done for the Badgers. Wheeler, no look feed. Liddell underneath off the glass and in. That was tremendous. And back comes Wheeler. Red guard, he's not shy about his team shooting lows. First Liddell up top, that doesn't go. He said, we're going to be a streaky team in terms of... So far, this Ohio State team, a little bit cold. They've been very good shooting the ball a year, but there's been some ugly shots. Not that. <laughs> Nothing ugly about that. <laughs> Have that step back jumper. And I think when you look at Brad Davis in this year, he's made real strides shooting from two. His percentages tell that story. Now Wall went for the seal. That one on one against Wall. Liddell in the paint. Beats scores in one. Liddell against Ilver, beats him easily. That's twice now we have seen E.J. Liddell. 
Crowell denies key for now, opens up, he's up the lane. Liddell, good defense from Wall. It'll stay with the Buckeyes, but really good defense there for them. And those guys have combined for 24 of the 31 Wisconsin points. Liddell spins on the freshman, rises and misses off the glass. Job of recognizing they had disadvantaged basketball. Liddell late getting back, and that was a contested shot at the rim. Liddell along the baseline, no, wanted a foul. Good defense by Stephen Crown. Is that the next whistle? Here's Liddell off the Wheeler feed. Long rebound comes back to the Buckeyes against Indiana. They've done that at a high level all year. They don't turn the basketball over. And Can't do a rebound for Zed Key. That's his seventh rebound to go with 10 points. Davison down the paint. Liddell challenges it one. Wheeler against both. Cut off. Now Liddell. No panic with this guy. And six. He looks it down. Liddell, 21 points. He is the top for three. And Liddell with that rebound away from Davis. Over Carlson, two more for E.J. Liddell, 25 points. You're, you're talking about the best freshman and sophomores in, in college basketball. Liddell on the baseline. He is so good at just facing you up. Father, we'll talk about that a little bit tonight. So congratulations to Terry and his fiance Sharia. Three ball now by Liddell, and he scores it for Ohio State. Here's Jamari Wheeler, transfer out of Penn State, 55 and white for the Buckeyes. It's back inside, and Liddell is going to work as well. To play in the X group, isn't he? Yeah, and you look at the productivity of those guys all across the board and down the bottom, Cam Holden, who's not only can score, but can board it and assist it as well. Townsend does as good a job as anybody I've seen this year of spacing the floor, moving the ball, finding the open shooter. That's a four shot. Liddell misses, rebound Gibson, Towson. Wheeler, up top Liddell for three. Yeah, And a box out from Key by Gibson. Helping down on Liddell, double teaming him. Liddell, a three, the shot clock winding down. Offensive rebound and put back up. And Liddell, deep three. Long rebound tapped out to Sessoms. Let's see if Penn State, who's got a little cold here of late from the floor, can get back in it. Nice drop down to Hera. Sessoms. Congestion into the paint, Hera there. Good patience by Liddell. Now he's got one on one. And Liddell backing down. Good defense that time by Jelani White. And White comes over late. He does a nice shot from Penn State. Inside, Liddell had the advantage. Well, that's good recognition, too, by Kyle Young. Good defense. Liddell right there cleans up his own rebound. And the horn sounds. Ohio's lost to Miami in their last game, but you can see he's got some offensive skills. And the double team took the ball out of Zed Key's hands. Too easy from Liddell on the entry pass. The deck. Right back to EJ Liddell. Backing down. Quick shot. Turnaround jumper short. Good picking a lot of credit points on the night. Good trap on Wheeler. Oh. Showtime. That's a way to break. Played well. This is the matchup. Liddell versus Bancaro. Fade away. And that's too hard, too. And you can tell everybody's a little amped up here in front of almost 20,000. Number one than any coach in NCAA history. Good job by Wendell Moore to take away Branham's backdoor look. That was designed for a backdoor. And so far, E.J. Liddell has had challenge play by E.J. Liddell. 
Isoed in the post against Theo John. And one! It will go to the free throw line. EJ Liddell spurt. Try to get a shot for Justin Arns. Instead, it's Liddell in the paint. Mm, strong. Right over the outstretched arm of Theo John. He combined. I did. I, I missed the. I did miss the Elvis. I wish we could bring that back. But we will. Liddell, three. Good. That was a deep ball. And that's what each. Give Ohio State a little bit of a different look. Turn around and shot. Free throw line, no good. Young could have grabbed that instead. He tried instead. He tried to slap it out. And here comes leads the ACC in assists. And you heard about his voice and the message that was sent with about 12 minutes to go. That Gonzaga game, he took over that huddle. And the players take over. That's a huge sign, and he did. Right now, it's been one on one, and they're beating their man. Liddell. That's blocked. Williams picks up another one. He's got a couple in this game off a game in which he. Liddell. Tough shot. Got it! AJ Liddell up to four. <laughs> Look at this defense. So this is right how Florida was the other night. They get after you. Orange to Liddell. Liddell, yes. How about that? Nice little help defense. Nick, you say he can elevate. And instead, he gets it out to Wheeler. And there's a repost. Backing him down, fading short. And now they are soft rims here for Myers. Off the mark that time for Brandon. Look at the offensive rebound. Boy, E.J. Liddell. The power and not fouling by going over. A lot of toughness in these kids. Yeah, two programs that are going to be making this a knockdown drag out fight. Liddell hits the shot. He thought he got hit on the arm, too. He knew he was. Who was Here's Michi Johnson, the hero the other night, hit the three pointer to win it. And Russell getting some time. Nice ball fake. A tough shot. Yeah. Trying to jump people. Racing it up, Brandon McK And pursues it. Cutting. Oh, they might have had him cut to the basket there. He wants to get a little ISO here. Liddell going to work. He's already in double figures. Yeah, much better move that Thompson. Giving it off. Russell hit the three earlier. This guy's been quiet. Arns, they haven't let him get his shot away. Nice entry. Liddell. Pretty. That is pretty. How about that? The little hook pass to the post to the one of many. Oh, come on. You <laughs> won almost a couple hundred games at Seton Hall. Driving inside. Liddell rejected Castleton. That's his game. Uh, gives the little. Uh, Wheeler wanted to get it to Liddell. He does up top five to shoot. Liddell lets it go and knocks it down. Well, he had to post up a floor. Good things happen. It goes through him. Liddell driving, stopping. Yes. How about that power? To be concerned. And Florida's got to make sure they check out. Sotos, here's Liddell. He's going to elevate. Four to shoot. Leading in. No. Tapped out. Rebound to Jones. Wheeler, the Penn State transfer. 18 assists, three turnovers. He's been good. Now Liddell rejected by Ike Obiagu. Ike in the right spot. That is Herman in its fourth year of existence. Best crowd we've had. That's what you got to do. You're going to get clean looks. Move Ike around. Obiagu doesn't show, doesn't have the foot speed to counter. <laughs> or somewhere thereabouts <laughs> in the ballpark. Proximity. Yeah. Liddell, here you go again. Stepping out and knocking go. down the three. That's a great matchup. Chris Holman taking advantage. 2 3 zone that he played in. He's great at jumping passing lanes as well. Nice handle here in the step back. This time, Liddell missing. It's only the third missed shot we've had. Eight in our opener. Uh, uh, Willer can make that three. You can't give him that opportunity. Nice little cross screen. And a block by Jared Roden. Early. I like to see him go to the rim. He's more effective. Random. Early post. 
Two what? times in a row. This time he wins the battle. How about the speed to get there and duck in and bang? Yeah, they were trying to stay fresh after a great start. Both teams shooting 8 of 15 from the floor. Here's Liddell. Well, the little layoff didn't affect uh, him. Not at all. But a better match, though, defensively. Just elevated a little more. Guy has... How about that? E.J. Liddell, who had eight blocks against Xavier. And then Whoa. on the other end. Tell me, how good is this kid? Plays on selflessly for the match. And they get it into Zed Key. Nice cut. And what a pass. <laughs> How about the adjustment as well? He knew Roden was on the right. A little hang time, but a big... To that COVID year, he's a six-year senior, Bryce Aiken. Liddell, top of the arc. I really didn't get himself organized on that one. Contested threes are tough. Yeah. Right now, Michi Johnson getting it over here. Cedric Russell. A little bit of a match now. Boy, it's got them confused. They're not running their action. Palang is wide open if they so choose. Miller tapped that out, the little guy. And here he is in transition. Nice cut. Wow. What a find. Liddell knows what to do with it. Secondary break. Good acknowledgement. As well. Switch by yeah. Samuel. So now, Liddell leaning in. Still got it. Stuff. He's so strong, he can take a lick and deliver. It, he's calling for and it. No, nobody coming to help either. He can just elevate. He does. He thought he got hit on the arm. No call. It's actually oh, going for Chris Holman. They go away, do they? Just like in Michigan when they were down 11 and they never gave up and they ended up winning it. Was calling he for wanted him. it. They got to switch back. Liddell against Obiagu. Wow. Back Look at Young. Board. Young putting his body on the line. It is. Is he going to take him off the bounce? The taller Obiagu. What does he do? He pulls up for three. No. Follows his own miss. And that's the leader for this Musketeer ball club. And I look for Key to get some touches underneath. That big, strong body, great duck in ability. And look, no Fremantle, but this kid is getting minutes, and he, they're going to be a force at that center spot. Yeah, when Fremantle comes back, they're going to have a lot of weapons. Tap back, no good. Key, no again, but Ohio State will not give up, and finally Liddell cleans it up in the paint. And very easy, not good defense, not Playing attention to detail. Just a little dribble drive, no container whatsoever. In and out and back down for the go. junior E. Johnson, but showing the mid range and puts Xavier back up a half dozen. And that hurt him at, at the end of the year when he was injured. Hurt Xavier, I should say. Both. And he's got that inbound it. They do get it in. He, key, though, you see him down low. He's got that derriere at 6'8, 250. There's a foul on the rebound, and we're going to... They're trying to get it into Liddell. They do. Here he goes. And there's a whistle. Count the bucket right on cue, E.J. Liddell. Well, oh, it's really... Offensive board. Tap back, yes. Third time's a charm. Well, they can attack now. You can see how aggressive they can be at that rim. He... Here's Liddell, isolated with Scruggs, the two stars. Bounce him in and turn around jump shot. And he gets the bounce, and Ohio State's Three. back within five. No question what Chris is after. Now a chance to make this a one possession game. You know where they're going. They're going to Liddell. Absolutely. Good defense. Down low. Key stringing it out. No backside coverage. He didn't drop quick enough. And then's the alert. Good answer by E.J. Liddell. He, did, he provides. Down inside, Liddell on the other end. Rejected by Colby Jones. And how about the blow by Scruggs? Oh, one of the biggest kisses for Xavier all night. And now the three from the wing. He got it. Liddell hits the three. Right one. The first possession here for the Falcons. Out to E.J. Liddell, and that's one way that he has kind of stretched out his game, especially.
especially they mentioned Branham, who is a freshman who's getting the start here today. And certainly, Chris Holman did not expect to lose Dwayne Washington. I, I think he just he worked out well and ended up being up one of those deals where. And a 20 to 4 advantage here for the Buckeyes. Looking inside to Liddell. There's some more paint points. They're starting to add to that tally. They got eight now here to start, including Plowden. Again, their, their leading scorer, a guy who averages about 16, still scoreless here in this first half. And look out, Liddell's starting to get comfy cozy. I mean, that, that would be his. To back, to back buckets now for Bowling Green. Largest lead has been 20 here for the Buckeyes. Liddell can't get that one. As well as Eugene Brown here early in the second half. Bowling Green going on a 3-2 zone. That's a zone buster right there. <laughs> 15 feet out. DJ Liddell just cut to these says the in-conference deal. Where you have players like a Jamari Wheeler who's played at Penn State for four years. It's going to take some getting used to it, especially because of the old rule. Did you have a team like that when you were playing in the conference? And it was against the rules. You, you no, 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 no. Like, did you have a team that you always kind of had their number that it would just be right there? Starts off hot for the Purple Eagles. He can score like crazy from a lot of different spots in the floor as EJ Liddell buries a three from the top of the arc. Just a great find. Giving a second chance, and they're not going to give up against the, the bigger Ohio State Buckeyes. Guys. Cintron's a really good player as Liddell hits yet another long-range shot. Cintron's got the opening stretch. Not much you can do when Marcus Hammond's just chucking up threes and making all of them right there. Good defense from Ohio State, but Hammond continues to shoot lights out. A couple of one and duns for the Buckeyes from Worcester, Massachusetts in there for the first time. Liddell. Fakes drives with the right hand, soft touch, and it's good. Excellent drive there from EJ Liddell. You get a chance to see the big man Tuba Traore come in as Arns and Liddell go to work. EJ Liddell with two. That's just knowing, but that's going to be tough now. Wheeler on top of him in the rest of this half. Liddell from outside the right elbow, pure. Nicely done, E.J. Liddell, hardly contested. He's putting up. He's got a chance to go down. Liddell catch and shoot. They're giving him that look all day. Made a couple early, missed that one. Michi Johnson second chance, and he got... Skip pass to Michi. Wants to drive the baseline. Liddell wide open. E.J. buries one of his own. A sharp shooting spark. They're really pressuring the ball. Liddell along the baseline, he commands attention and space. Created his own shot nicely, but didn't finish it off there. Niagara. Cedric Russell, who by the way is not with the team tonight because of a uh, family matter that he needs to attend to. E.J. Liddell turns around and scores from the paint, so he's at 20 points, just a minute and a half. Started and then kind of slowed down. I think Jamari Wheeler took notice and the rest of the players on Ohio State that they need to guard this guy tight as Liddell uses the tough finish. I over I Oreo to extend the lead to five. Tim Arns grabs it away from the Thomason miss. Another look at the dunk on the other end. Liddell shoots a rhythm transition three, hits the front of the rim, and here come the Purple Eagles. Three on. Buckeyes go back to work with EJ Liddell, and he got flat out stuffed. Chris Holtman wants a foul. Jordan Cintron says it's all ball. Liddell fighting his way around. He puts it up. Let's see if it's a shooting foul. It sure is. Count the bucket, plus one. Great job by E.J. Liddell being aggressive. Coach Greg Paul. Line after a good start where they hit their first six in a row. They're seven of 15 since then. Liddell's three off the front of the rim. Almost caught Kyle Young on the forehead, so instead. That's for Wheeler, giving it up late shot clock. Second chance for the Buckeyes, and Liddell who misses right on the doorstep. You have to wonder how much this Acker team got from that West Hard to absorb contact. And I think that's what you saw. Look at oh, the stop. I, you mentioned it months ago. They were celebrating his legacy together on the sideline today. Liddell 
defended well, and this will be Akron basketball. The chip away. And, and they can do so with their patience and their physicality. But this is an Akron team that has good physicality and athleticism as well. What a rim run by Liddell that time, John. He again trying to pivot out of a triple team. Eugene Brown won't take the shot. Here's Liddell for three, and a line drive goes down. And Liddell's going to have to. Thank you. You and Twitter. That is great. Glad to be in that boat. <laughs> Here's Liddell off the speed from Wheeler, and Liddell pumps up another mid-range jumper, which he is so good at. About, I mentioned it before. It's not about stopping the basketball. It's not about getting the turnover, you know, picking up the steal. Oh, it's Dr. Liddell again. Don had the first bucket for Akron in the first half. He got the first one here in the second half. And see what Ohio State has as an answer. It's a catch and shoot for Liddell that's short. And the rebound does go to Akron. Picked up early. You get picked up early, you got spacing on offense. So that shot is there. That is a good look. A transfer from USF, Castaneda. Now Liddell misses the three. It's a long rebound for 15-1 run for Akron, John. Yeah, Akron really found some confidence here. The first play where, where you execute well in the half court. That gives you confidence. And then this is a field jumper. Oh, my God. I knew, I knew you were going somewhere that he's going to make me cringe and polite laugh. Yeah, well, you didn't even do that. He just buried me. So I was great. too busy. I was down, makes a defensive play, which would have been a layup. For K.J. Walton. He sure ain't taking a three. We know that, right, Jason? He is not taking a three. He didn't make a three all of last year and months. Tough lineup for Ohio State, and I think that's something Chris Holtman and staff are, are going to be watching very closely. Who can play well together? Yeah, they don't really have a feel for that as yet as Liddell just barrels into the lane for two more. Make of the season, and now a juggle by Johnson just to recollect. Ohio State is out of sorts again. Step back on a line drive. Liddell has been the fixer all night long. <laughs> Make two-point baskets. Lean in for Branham. Second chance. Liddell had it pancaked from behind. What a block. How about the amount of time Branham's got in his first game as a collegiate player? Liddell, no. Ohio State team, top 25 team. And yes, it's a preseason top 25, but... You look at the pieces, 1,001 games played uh, with guys on this team. Wow, great defense by Freeman on Liddell. Crowd getting into it now. About 10 to shoot. Castaneda turned it over. Liddell and Ohio State the other way. 14 and a foul. Back to a point where you can include E.J. Liddell into the conversation. That's there he is. Turning his back off the spin, Liddell. Him giving Brown with three fouls, but Jalen Pickett does that to everybody. Russell set play for him to get a look, and he knocks it down. Really nice play, center of Russell. Jimmy Sotos, the YouTube TikTok sensation, on the court now for the Buckeyes. Inside, Brook again. Joey Brook. Devontae Jones is hurt. Ohio State with an advantage, Arns again! Just enough! The decisions you make early, the easier the game gets throughout the course of this game. So again, listen, no Zed Key, he's still out with an ankle, and yeah. no time. I tell you, just rolls right yeah, off the tongue. Does. Good job on the clear, force him to double. Jamar Wheeler, has got to take the shot. Three. Yep. Got to take it and knocks yep. it down. We talked about it. We, we said it. Jamar Wheeler. If you love the energy that that freshman brings to them off the bench. Here's Liddell. Wheeler, another open shot. Got it. Move out to Liddell. Now Branham curling and hitting. That's quite a one-two combo. It sure is, and he is as good. Russell will play to Louisiana. Drag transfer. Shot clock at three. Liddell. Russell. Three. Look at nice shot. Well, Kevin, he made 266 three. Liddell. Back 
out to Young. And the three ends the run. And Young with a little bit of verbiage for his own bench. E.J. Liddell thought he might stop and pop. Instead, he finds Brown. And Brown finds the bottom of the bucket. I'll tell you what. And we, we hated Garden County. I mean, he just ran off 18,000 picks. Beautiful backdoor. And an easy slam for Brandon and Ohio State for the first time has a double-digit lead. And they I mean, first of all, for him to... I mean, that was a number that meant something to him, too, personally. It's Cy Young with a jab and a five. E.J. Lavelle had the pull to just four first-half points. He touches it with three to shoot, two to shoot. Wheeler has to launch the three, and he rolls it home. They used every millisecond. Double Liddell pushing him out. He has just four tonight. Wheeler, the open man, with the three, and Jamari Wheeler has hit two from deep. Elite defensive player. You shoot the rock. It's a guy that you just want on your team. Dickinson crowded out Liddell, and he still found key. Well, good patience by E.J. Liddell, but really good. On Brandon, that's going to be a great matchup, matchup to watch. Right now, it's Mulcahy against Liddell. Zed Key coming off a great performance last time out as the first bucket tonight for the Buckeyes. Had such good position, he didn't actually have three-point percentage than Ron Harper Jr. As to that, meanwhile, Brandon left wide open, and the outstanding freshman answers. Rucker switching ball screens, and they just totally lose. Liddell, skip pass, Wheeler for three, and the Buckeyes are red hot from beyond the arc this half. It's such a good pass of E.J. Liddell on the play. The foul was called on McConnell. He has four. And as Young misses... So he's establishing and controlling. E.G. Johnson coming back from that facial fracture, wearing the mask. For some, it's an improvement. <laughs> and the jumper goes down on this lead. A little duck in again for Key. Much better job by Scott. They play smaller now. And that's one way to beat the zone. If you're Malachi Branham and you So half court set here for Ohio State with a 12-6 advantage. Uh, they had the mismatch when Liddell passed it up. Nice skip pass. And count it. Malachi Branham with a downtown hit. Enjoy. Popped up in the air, controlled by Liddell. Ohio State is running. Liddell outside. Arms. Got three. How about that dribble drive? Collapse the D. An easy two. Well, he's got some length at the top of that zone. Don't give this kid that look. Arns. There you go. A three, Justin Arns. Kaboom. He does a great job with the size saddle. Jimmy Jackson's at number two. And, and Ohio State hitting the defensive glass. Here's Wheeler, puts it in the deck. Oh. Underneath Williams, the theft. Yep. Due to the tournament, 12 times in his 16 years, what a run it's been here. Off the steal, Branham, what a pass by Liddell, and the freshman coming with some heat. I was looking for the uh, Ivy fitted. Big basket down the stretch. 12 point game. Liddell out to Young, this is a three. That's good. Uh, I think they're going to get away from the zone. They get strong. Liddell with the board. Here's Branham. Two dribble pull up. And it rolls in. Rarely do you see a ball. You score 18 plus points a game. He's got the size too. And when so many teams switch, you can seek it out if you're patient enough. Branham again. Go. Another two go. dribble pull up. Yeah, you can see the touch in that shot. But I'm a great floor spacer. Daniels lost it. Here comes Adele. Throws it up for Branham and he lays it in. Branham now with six. It's just one of those programs you just need to see them right the ship and sometimes you need the reboot unplug the computer plug it back in Cedric Wilson Knocks down that jump Liddell Jeez. another offensive rebound. He was surrounded on that one, too And Russell knocks down another three how many times him watching his team from his basement went viral. It was really cool to see how into the game he was watching from abroad as Zed Key scores the first bucket of the game for Ohio State. But it was the last.
Jamari Wheeler playing in his 143rd college basketball game. Has it now and fires the three. It's good. Jamari Wheeler, he makes quick decisions. Uh, they're really good offensively, but they're allowing IUPUI's just kind of strange defenses to slow them down a bit. But, hey, we mentioned the cross-court passes from Egypt. Defensively, transition defense, three-point defense, and then forcing turnovers as well. And they were good in all three of those phases. Zed Key. So Liddell and Key with back-to-back -back buckets to get this down. In games. Played 114 of those in a Penn State uniform over the last four years. Up top, Branham wide open, and he knocks it down. The freshman from Columbus, Malachi Branham. Win in 31 years That's yesterday. Right. <laughs> Just down the road in Cincinnati. Arns trying to get back in his shooting stroke, and that'll help as he knocks down the three. Chris Bartle, the Mayfield, Kentucky. Y además contribuyendo los que vienen también de la banca, buen enceste aquí por parte del de jumper. Actividad no ha habido defensa, ahí está, bien, el... uy, la falló. Fácil, la sumida de Zed Key. The yeah, second or third possession on Northwestern has just been weak finishing around the rim. That was a great extra pass by Liddell and leads to the brand of three with how they've settled in and fought back here. Absolutely. In the corner, well, just as I say that, yet another three, this one by Cedric Russell. Ran right, right into Verge. Liddell kicks it out, there's Branham. Pretty good, the freshman Malachi Branham coming off of a really tough game against Wisconsin. Just so good defensively, Jamar Wheeler is. Two-time all-defensive team in the Big Ten Conference as Branham knocks down another three. That's such a good thing. Leg surgery for Brighton Bach on the 22nd of December. Branham has knocked down three threes in the early going. Man, just easy gear. And you talk to Fred Hoiberg. That was the one thing that he wasn't worried about going into the season. Russell fires away from three. The transfer from Louisiana gets into the action. Well, I think each offensive rebound to go along with it on that same sequence. He's playing with four fouls, too. Wheeler. Another big three for Jamari Wheeler. Simple offense. You get Liddell. You see if Webster's going to dig or not. Liddell feeling the pressure outside. Michi Johnson. Huge three by Michi Johnson. Six-point lead for the Buckeyes. Liddell against Wall. Johnson left side for three. Double team is coming to EJ. Backs him down. Johnson poked it free. Johnson playing great here in the second half. Bees Liddell. Touch pass key with a two hand dunk. The deep was a directed pass to Wall, but he could not connect. And now here comes Liddell. Ohio State has been phenomenal. How about this pass? I thought he'd make a jump, much like I thought about Keegan Murray at Iowa. Both those guys, six man on their team last year on good teams. And one for Young is Liddell. Brandon on the kick. There it is. You got it. Here's Key, another hook, and scores it again. Yeah, he's catching it way too deep right now. Ohio State early, 11 minutes gone by in the first half. Liddell, nice feed inside, easy bucket for Kyle Young. See, that's where Liddell differentiates himself. And elevating his game. He only has a half of the Big Ten to go. He's got to elevate for Towson to win this game. Oh, it's for three, and he comes right back. by E.J. Liddell. Get the ball away from the double team. Get it inside Branham. Great vision from E.J. Liddell. Strong move by Branham to the basket. Mark. A little high-low action. He getting good position. He went right into the body of Mark Williams. Took away his shot-blocking ability. The shot clock. And E.J. Liddell. That's a good pass to Key. Williams recovers. A little late. And then he gave up position to Zed Key. 
love the three-pointer. He takes a lot of the mid-range twos. Will he continue to try to develop a three-point shot or no? Yes. Oh, absolutely. And he's got a good touch. Yeah. But his game. Key Williams has three fouls and now triple teamed. Good pass. Russell wide open. Three. That's just a great pass. And Liddell was strong. Rather than three feet shorter than you, just yeah. maybe two and Anything a half. to make you taller, I think you should do. Would be good. Key in the paint puts it in. He's just getting deep position. And when you can post deep enough. Ten on the shot clock. Good defense by Moore. They get into Williams and another tough shot over Williams said Key. Four seasons at Charleston. Last year, he averaged 20 points a game. Of course, that's a different level, but it just shows you he can fill it up. Oh, here's a lob. Look out. Attacking and make... Bronx started, but did not play many minutes. Just four in that first half. Here he is, Arns. Right on the money. Wow. Unbelievable. It is so pretty. It is gorgeous. The fluidity. They got what they want inside. Here he is, double team, kick it out, Wheeler. Yes, nothing but the bottom of the net. Very unselfish, too. Best over the course of his three years at Penn State. Put it on your side, then he can't beat you. Tough to beat that. Zed Key with another flush. Another raise the roof. Very perimeter oriented. And he's a very good catch and shoot guy, but they need guards to live in the paint. He can stay outside. He can shoot. Guards for Ohio State really in the first half have done a pretty good job rebounding the basketball. Justin Arns with the five rebounds in the first half. Even. And Zed Key continuing to go to work. He's but in he, double figure. Five points a game. He's come in. He's been aggressive. He's gotten to the rim. He's right there. Sticking a three. He's above that average right now with eight points. <laughs> Buckeyes out and running again. Arns. It's good! Just excellent transition offense from Ohio State. But down, only down two. You can tell the offense is starting to click now. They start off a little slow. Great inside. ball rotation. Branham to Liddell to Key for an easy dunk. Fashion 10 to shoot for Liddell. Cintron all over him. Up top, Jamari Wheeler. Spots a three. You don't see that that often from together. They played in college together. They played in college together. John Gross hired Chris Halton to be his assistant at Ohio. So a, a deep connection going all the way back to Paul. Kind of guy you want on your team if you want to play at a high level. Yeah, you know how that sounds. It sounds like when you call somebody a good guy and you, that means you don't have anything nicer to say. As he finishes, we're tied at four. Branham, the freshman on the drive. Offensive rebound off the miss from Malachi. Branham in the reload for three. And you do not want to miss that guy. And for all fans of yours, whether you're cheering for the Badgers or Buckeyes today. There has to be a foul on Wisconsin. It'll stick with Ohio State. You see, they've got multiple guys who are dealing with the flu and something that you have to get through. And so far, this Ohio State team a little bit cold. They've been very good shooting the ball a year, but there's been some. Here's Hepburn got around Wheeler. Now Carlson. Top shot off the mark. Liddell defending. Liddell with the rebound. Ben Carlson would have stayed in that corner. He would have had a wide open shot. His boat looking for help. He has it from Davison. Off the curl. Three doesn't go. And Liddell the rebound. His fourth rebound. Whoa. Well, Here's Liddell off the Wheeler feed. Long rebound comes back to the Buckeyes. Brandon baseline J. I like Tyler Wall in the middle. Let, let him make plays. It was Steven Crow last time. He airmailed it. Tyler Wall a better option. Davis, not sure if that was pulled or if that was a directed pass to Wall, but he could not connect. And now here's just one talented dude. As Carlson made the first, missed the second. Seven to shoot. Wheeler open. Russell for three. And Liddell with that rebound away from Davis. 
over Carlson. Hepburn for three. And Liddell against two Wisconsin Badgers has the rebound and a foul on Wisconsin. The unique big guy at 6'8", 245. Growing, young, getting better. And that was Arns on the three. He missed, but an offensive rebound, and they go inside for King. Here into this game, he came in off the wide bench open, at the time. Wide now. open, wide yep, open. Rizzuto again. Well, they pick on you, Mike. That's what I love about their offense. They find it. Hold it. Third it's reversal for Timberlake. of the possession. Timberlake's blocked inside by Liddell. You know, Liddell at 6'7", he averages... Three and six rebounds. I mean, he's just a guy you can rely on. There's going to be a foul on the Tigers. It's on Thompson. They're, they're budgetary issues. You know, but these are tough games to win on the road in the Big Ten. And believe me, everybody knows Ohio State's supposed to win. you got a legit win in these games. Too strong in the drive by Timberlake. Here's what Ohio State has coming up. So, be primed for another run, I'm sure, this season. They're going to go to 7-2 and two here in the early going with this win over Towson tonight. The final is going to be an 11-point. Should obviously yield some fireworks as well. Lundy tries to answer no, and Liddell with his first rebound. He has been a monster this season. E.J. Liddell up on Zed Key initially. Barnes nearly threw it away. Wheeler from the corner. Too strong offensive rebound by Liddell. Hot pack with hair on him. Seven minutes and change to go. Hera inside. Couldn't finish. Could have taken one more bounce and power to the basket. Liddell drive. Lundy, good defense. Liddell right there cleans up his own rebound. And the horn sounds. Ohio State. State. Dread, deep three. Rebound sky four by Liddell. Hera. Little foul just as. To... Almost two steals per game. He's the only player in the country in the country averaging over 17, 6, and 6. Yeah. And he's shooting over 50%. Missed the free throw. Going to be a tough test. Winning night. Ohio State's played in a handful of really close games. That's a contested shot. And the Buckeyes have come away with it. Duke struggling from the floor early. Two of six. Oh, dribbling, not a lot of movement for Duke. Give Ohio State's defense great credit for that. Kick open three. Too strong. Good hustle by Liddell. What a play. And keeps it alive. What a play by E.J. Liddell. Just a big-time shot blocker. Bancaro looking for points one and two. That's too strong. He's been a little strong here to start the game. We're at the halfway mark of the first half. And now Joey Baker with three on the shot clock. Gets it off by Archer. Halfway down. Good rebound by E.J. Liddell. Boxed out A.J. Griffin. He can <laughs> fix anything. Just installed the TV for a teammate, changed the battery in his car. Did a good job walling up defensively. He also has a pet snake. Ooh, well, you had me. That's a tough shot running and fading away. And it's a miss for Wendell Moore. Not a chance down five to cut it. And Arns to Ohio State. Ooh, not fouled and falling to the ground after he shot it was Roach really this game has come down to Ohio State to turn this game seven Two points nine yep seven points and you heard about his voice and the message that was sent with about 12 minutes to go that Gonzaga game he took over that huddle and the players take over. That's a Buckeyes need a stop. 49-36. More again? No. Off the front iron. A little zoom action. A little screen into a handoff. And that uh, that was a difficult. Baker tough fade away. That's an air ball. Oh, that is not a good shot. And Justin Arms has to stop going for that little ball fake. It opened up the middle. 
And Baker's not going to go baseline. Off. With three on the shot clock, two heels. No good. Bancaro went up, and that ball was tipped by Liddell. Liddell has 12 rebounds in this game. He's not going to cr get credit for that one, but kick out. Baker had it. Still 10 on the shot clock. Heels will launch. That short. Liddell rips it away, and Ohio State's got a chance to grab the lead. Well, Liddell has been. They are soft rims here for Myers. Off the mark that time for Brandon. Look at the offensive rebound. Boy, E.J. Liddell. The power and not fouling by going over. The NBA waters, and I think wise decision to come back. Very much so. They reconstructed Florida. Only yeah. four. Uh, he's missed his first three. All have been from outside the arc. Look at this ice job. Tough shot. Boy, how about that high arc? Or no good for Jones. And that's all the D. Tough. Both of these clubs. Appleby, left hand. Liddell says, no thank you. Well, there's the All-American right now, I think. Some big play. Look at this. Well, thought he was going to shoot him, but being a ramp. Here's Fleming. 19 points. What a night he's had. Fading. Missed. Weak side. Liddell. Big rebound. Line that one up and knocked it down. 20 to 7. Offensive woes continue for Penn State. Ooh, that one was kicked off the back of the heel of Wheeler. And now Dredd hits a three. For because Lee's there, the spacing wasn't great, but Pickett still made something happen. I think it's got four, and now we had the other direction offensive foul on the Buckeyes. Branham, another offensive board. I think it just didn't go get that rebound. I thought he had opportunities to go do so, just waiting on it. But Miles Dredd rips it, takes it right down the middle, and it's rejected. He puts the pass, Gus, where Brooks can catch it and ultimately use the rim as a protector and finish on the opposite side. And a steal. Brooks racing ahead. Left hand. Trying to push him out. Turns the corner. The kick. Liddell took his eyes off him. 12 turnovers for the Buckeyes as Johnson has helped into. Oh, Liddell on the ground gets tied up. Oh, I like it here. This is, <laughs> hey, this is a lot. Working on Marble. And he walked. I just feel like this is going to be good. I just feel like this happened during yeah. that regular season. Yeah. It's a whole new season, and they have just turned it up. Well, you got to turn the page, but at the same time, you have to go back to and, and adhere to what made you good throughout the season. Those edicts, yeah. I think about the offensive struggles, right? Like that, that's one thing. But defensively, that's something that's got to be there night in and night out. I think that's a frustration for Fred Hoiberg. That was a nice recovery, though, by Wiltshire. Russell off the bounce. Strong rebound. Boy, Liddell had it ripped away by Trey McGowan. And then Brown is going to pick up. Now with high brain. Liddell lost it. Cradles the ball on a tie-up. Position. No. Dodged the bullet there, though, oh, Jim, yeah. because Liddell had a real good look at the second shot. Yeah, and the line I kind of stopped because the shot went up, so now the re the clock is in there. Or not Parker Stewart, uh, Trey Galloway. Trey Galloway, yes, who you. brings you energy instantly, and that's to try that back door again with Michi. A good steal to Mark Bates, got the hand on it. Yep. Flying through, though, Kyle Young. That was just an effort play for the senior. But then thrown away by Liddell. And calmly, Xavier Johnson holds it up for Indiana. And then Johnson fouls it. Oh, boy. Well, Liddell frustrated. They kind of flipped Johnson to the ground. And now they're definitely going to have to go to the monitor to take it. Approaching the three-minute mark of the first half. Liddell. Bradham in a foul. And this is going to be an offensive foul against Ohio State. Looks like Liddell. Here comes the double. Liddell's a good passer. Cross court, nobody home. Yeah, by discontinuing his dribble, now that's double. Nine to shoot for the Bucks. Liddell 
Guarded by Chris Murray. Murray drives on him. Lost it. Picked up the man. And Murray in front. They give him a look. Well, the Buckeyes trying to crack the scoring column. They have not scored in almost three and a half minutes and battle with a takeaway. Yeah, make the easy play right there. There was a pass. One pass away. To Liddell. And poke free. And another turnover. Ball loose. And a foul is going to be called on Kyle Young. Defense. I mean, it's been a quiet night for Liddell. He's got his sixth double-double. 16 points, 10 rebounds. Foul on Wheeler, his fourth, and a timeout on the floor. Second one. And Liddell throws it away. I'm not sure Ohio State was fully aware of how much time was on the clock. They, there was enough time to really, as the defense shifts over, make your decisions. Mm. Ohio State's right. starting to get good looks. Yep. Liddell, another one, and they're going to call the offensive foul on E.J. Liddell. Missed just four shots here to start the second half. There's six of ten from the field. There's the turnover. And here comes Sutherland. You see IUPUI is just doing a lot of switching. Liddell has it poked away, and LaPersia picks it up for the 2019-20 season and then played last year at a Division II school in Texas, St. Edwards University. IUPUI takes the ball away as it's tipped to E.C. Tua. Into the game. That's going to put those guards certainly in a position to get more minutes as Liddell has a strip. Good defense by Pickett. Yeah, Michi Chanham has it taken away. But it's kicked right back to Liddell. His foot, though, is on the midcourt stripe, so Penn State's going to get it after all. We had a great look at it. It was just the. Haciéndose la difícil. Oh, que pasó el balón muy rápido, pero aún así lo controló bien Jonathan Davis. Pausa de tres. No, le cierra el camino. Bien, se le impone Brad Davison. Roba el balón. Wisconsin se cruzó muy bien. Chris Hodges. Ya Cedric Russell en el Alexandria. En el estado de Luisiana. Jonathan Davis. Fuera. Y otro robo. Es el tercero que tiene Wisconsin. 7220 for the Fairlay Dickinson transfer. Oh, Liddell careless. Barry with another steal. Liddell chasing. And he got to him. They say it's a clean block. Northwestern 12 of 15. Liddell, of course, they're going to play through him, but he traveled there, shuffled his feet. Good defense by Robbie Barron. Mark State, my goodness. Those <laughs> <laughs> arms out there, you really got to hook him. Such a threat. Uh, offensive foul, put that shoulder down. Pretty good defensive maneuver. Kid... He got a game high 14. Entry pass. And it goes the other way. Uh, the Orange didn't let him get set up. That guy's to inbound. To Liddell. Liddell. Picks on the brakes. Picks up top. Galloway puts a hand on it. Galloway. Foul. A little late. I'll lead by 11. Liddell. Liddell just can't find anything. We got a jump ball. Possession arrow to the Hoosiers. See the Liddell backed away. Derek Walker forced the other turnover. Seven. Ford, Ohio State in the paint in that first half, 18 to 12. Can Nebraska continue to battle in the post? And there is an offensive foul on Liddell. Pushing off and maybe a little bit of frustration here from Liddell. Good action there, though. Yep, that's exactly what Fred Hoiberg has wanted. A little tweaks to his offense. Here comes Liddell. Full head of steam and an offensive foul. Derek Walker draws the charge. I would think it would be more Tyler Wall. Now, if that's going to be the matchup, then you're going to see E.J. Liddell drive the ball, go inside more. Tyler Wall, a very good defender, and a nice play right there by Wisconsin defending that pass. And for all guys. And now Davis with the steal. This should be fun. Davis all the way with the hammer. Just Basket, but the first displacement, the official called. Defender a little bit too aggressive. 
How about that? That's an offensive. Yes, that's a good call. EJ Liddell going right into the defender. Thompson. Right idea by Gibson as he tried to find Thompson. Buckeyes the other way. Good touch pass inside on the steal by Jawan Gray. Well, Ohio State's been really loose. Glass of milk after the game. <laughs> yeah, Dayton is. Uh, they're up and down, right? But they got a young team. They're learning to play with each other. And they knew there was going to be a little bit of a learning curve earlier this year. But yeah. they're, they're budgetary issues. You know, but these are tough games to win on the road in the Big Ten. And believe me, everybody knows Ohio State's supposed to win. you got to legit win these games. For people that didn't even deserve his empathy. That's maturity. That's E.J. Liddell. Absolutely. A ton of it here today. It was great talking to him. And you're right. He's going to have an outstanding career because of those reefs connected he's had of a team at Towson since he's been there. There, In terms of players wanting to play for each other. Right? Yeah. There. Already I've got that locked up. <laughs> I am ready to go. Christmas 2021. Here we come. All right. Good to hear. It's an 11 point game here. From the corner to strong offensive rebound by Liddell. Hot pass. Hera goes down to the paint. Turnover Ohio State. And to play here this first half. Mismatch. Nobody home in the corner. Another turnover for Ohio State. And then Arms on the break. Just spots up. You got to find him. Another assist for Wheeler. This one a steal from Dread. Numbers for Penn State. And you missed them both. So here Ohio State, and you're looking at foul. That's a guy who's fouling. Speaking of foul, Dread nearly punked it away. Thing that, that they're told. But he's been an excellent shooter his entire career at Ohio State and a great scorer. Joey Baker, the senior into the game with a nice layup inside, cuts the lead down to four. Really good minutes against Gonzaga coming in to spell Mark Williams, who was absolutely spectacular in that game. Just a bad pass. Yeah, it was. Joey Baker had an arm out in the passing lane. You got to make a pass. That 1987, remember it well in upstate New York. Well, I'm not sure it erases the memory that on the other end. Liddell one more time. Tough pass, good hands from Young, and here they go again. Roach, Mark Baker. Got it! He would have that off arm protecting the ball. He can elevate. And Liddell tries to elevate, but taken away. Yeah, McKissick. Now, Cat. Liddell. Oh, he can elevate now. Nice slap away. Man. He lost it, I guess. He did. And McKissick. Look, look at him. Well, they take pride, don't they? <laughs> Team has 30 blocks on the season. Castleton has half of those. Yeah, it's offensive. They got Liddell with a chicken wing. And that is frustrating, too, defense. Dodos. Here's Liddell. 13 points. Had a charge free. Oh, they are Look amazing. at this. Fleming is coming easy. Liddell. I thought he might pull that. He wants to back Castle to down. It's tough to no, that tough look. And, so this, yeah. and this is only the first game. Cal and Florida next on the opening night of the Fort Myers tip-off event. And that one taken away. Jameer Harris. Nice play. Right. You notice that Deontay Miles guarding the inbound right now, staying on the floor. Travis Steele opting to keep him out there with those two personals. Yeah. And that's a travel. Still denying though. Liddell trying to right back. Dan Hunter. Offensive foul on EJ Liddell. Oh, just a little too deep. For college basketball. First points here for Bowling Green. Yeah, Cam! And ripped away that time by Cam Young. That was really well done by Cam Young. Here tonight. Takes it inside, and the kick out that time to Eugene Brown. Offensive rebound, Liddell gets it. And he walks with it. There was a way. It popped in and out. Good box out there from Suing. 
Here come the Buckeyes. Liddell wants to show off his power dribble, and he got it stripped. Cintron with a tight game. Neither team has really opened up a big lead. The Buckeyes' largest lead is four. Niagara's biggest lead was six when they led 14 to eight. Ohio State's played pretty good. There's a takeaway. Good pass up the floor. Arns to Branham, and it's bobbled under the bucket. Liddell just couldn't hang on to it. You can tell Liddell wishes he had that one back. He, he went over to high five. Cintron trips at the end after looking at the Ohio State students section. But a great aggressiveness in the inside and a sloppy turnover from Ohio State. Liddell tried to feed Keegan a bit, but he certainly shined nicely at the end of the year when Ohio State really needed him. And of course, C.J. Walker, who was such a good leader for this team, also is no longer with the Buckeyes. Hug up a little bit more to deter that shot. So he shouldn't take Billy Joel's defensive advice. Ali, don't you go downtown? <laughs> Should have we gone downtown. We did talk about Billy Joel earlier. Pick and roll, Jones, he's still hot. Diabate strip. Yeah, that's how Diabate, you bring the ball down, you go from being 16 to Now McGowan trying to drive it, and Liddell able to knock it off his foot, and it heads the other way. To dissuade what they had to do as far as their game plan. Ohio State led by as many as 11. Mm -mm, bad pass. And a good job defending by Liddell. Chris Murray cut off, Arns, under four to play, to sunk, explodes to the basket, and loses it out of bounds. About to set the screen. That time Wheeler keeps his feet on the ground, tipped around a couple of times, and a turnover. Geo Baker could just grab that basketball and try to tip it. Five to shoot, Mulcahy. Against Liddell, bounce pass in traffic and a turnover. He's doing a little bit of everything right now. He's led Purdue to the tournament 12 times in his 16 years. What a run it's been here. Off the steal, Branham. What a pass by Liddell and the freshman coming with some. I still think he has great value, even though he's not making shots. It's a great floor spacer. Daniels lost it. Here comes Liddell. Throws it up for Branham and he... Brown. Backing his way down, stripped away. Good defense there from Liddell. AJ Liddell just came down and took that ball from Stephen Crowell. Oh, he has never taken this kind of life, man. <laughs> man, college athlete. Feels like Kyle Young's been at Ohio State for a long, long time. Right through the hands of Jelani White. Back, and then you gotta wait till January. Pretty good litmus test to see where your club is before you go into the holidays. DJ Liddell picked the pocket of Pickett. Say that again. Buzzer beater against Florida. Era lost it. Liddell fouled. Still a couple to give for Penn State. They've done for Phillip here this weekend. Just excellent that Phillips able to come here to Ohio State, experience what game day's like for basketball and football, and have a great weekend. Hope he enjoys his time. Back on the floor, it's been a little chaotic. Success as just a post player. But if you understand who you are, you don't play, play, uh, play beyond your own skill set. Nice strip by Liddell. He told us earlier today, we spent 10, 15 minutes. He's going to play more. That's for sure. Too, right? Sessoms fighting Lee. Lee with one to shoot, has it rejected. Liddell and brought that rebound. I thought he had opportunities to go do so, he was just waiting on it. But Miles Dredd rips it, takes it right down the middle, and is rejected by E.J. Liddell, the leading shot blocker. The Dentley right there, Zed Key, and have come down on it and re-injured it a little bit. Jones turns the corner, right hand. That ball rejected by Liddell. One of the best used the rim as a protector and finish on the opposite side. And a steal. Brooks racing ahead. Left hand rejected by Liddell. No, no. Arns trying to be the post, throws it away. Brooks, nice pass. Houston ahead of the field. Block. Diabate will pound it down. What a 
pass. By you as a coach don't have to tell the guys about it anymore. Hopefully the things that they instinctually learn on their own. Under three. Walker drives, hangs, short, follow. Speaking of difficult, I mean, like E.J. Liddell can just hit difficult shots. He finds a way to put the ball in the bucket. Fourth in the league in scoring, and he can also block shots as well, but a putback counted, and he misses the mid-range jumper. Verge right down the pipe, but it's knocked out of bounds and off of Verge, so we will head the other direction. He was playing with a lot of confidence on the offensive end of the floor, certainly feeling pretty good about the way that they have played, and particularly that win at Penn State. Good hands by Liddell to knock it free, but Andre able to... Now Mayan on the trail. And a rebound here for McGowan. Finding Burge. Rejection third of the night for Liddell. He's mad. He's got to get aggressive to the rim. And it's a guy playing in his 153rd game tonight in college. What a block by Liddell. Seven to shoot. Burge comes to get it. Drives on Liddell. Good defense, and then Liddell throws it off of him. Out of college basketball games, these players on the floor have played here for Maryland. A lot. Oh, look at him. Take it in, sneaking inside Liddell's defense. And Wheel has missed his last four shots. He came off the bench and got the Terrapins up by two. Or got the Buckeyes up by two. Ayala inside. And Liddell timed it beautifully, knocked it away. Comfortable changing direction and then finishing above the rim with his left hand. Bummer on the run, swatted out of bounds by Liddell. Maybe of the first half. Lob inside to Coburn. Working around Young and Liddell. Liddell got a piece of that one with a rejection and saved by Brown. Right, and that's what Liddell is really good at, the help side. Got a body off of Young who was able to tip it in. Coburn inside and Liddell there to clean it up again. You talked about how he cleans up so much stuff defensively. Fought into trying to be a three-point shooter because that's not his game yet. Anderson on the attack, and he's blocked inside by Liddell. Really good defensive play again. Oh, yeah. Pull-up jumper. <clears throat> Off the front rim. Branham trying to keep it alive. And out of the back. But Euless, Euless can't get it done. Wheeler the other way. And the ball scooped out, picked up. Outlet pass. Here's McCaffrey. And rejected out of bounds by Liddell. Oh. I mean, that's for, if you taking it away. Chris Murray. McCaffrey to the hole. Tried to jam it, reject it again. Woo! Liddell getting on is working his tail off down there. Ten points on a four or five shooting. Chris Murray. Blocked again by Liddell. Inside to his brother. Adam. Jordan Bohannon. And look at the number of games. Right there. Is that that? No, that's the number of games. But the 427, J.J. Reddick. Great play that time. Minnesota down 13. Trying to find a way back in this one. This guy's going to have to lead the way. Willis inside with Key and Liddell crushing him in there. Daniels with the follow, and he'll go to the line. For a big guy. There is Brooks. Brandon Johns. He you know, Brooks is coming off, and Johns just didn't screen for him. Jones oh, wow. swatted away in the next Tuesday by Liddell. Also, not just from an effort and, and mobility standpoint, but from an IQ standpoint, too. I and mean, that was going to be a wide open shot. You get oh, Liddell is having an incredible night defensively. This is the baseline. I thought Caleb Houston could have shot that. Could have got to the other side, maybe gone reverse layup. Diabate denied another block by Liddell. He has been. Eight fades and white blocks. Okay, challenged by Liddell and a block. How about that? Ron Harper Jr. just. This is a tough a dribble drive team right now with the wide open middle. Ayala. The drive, the pump fake, rejected by Liddell. Ohio State comes in. Jimmy Jackson is at number two. And, and Ohio State hit the defensive glass. 
Here's Wheeler, puts it on the deck Ooh. underneath Williams, the theft. Long puts it on the deck to the wreck. Volleyball spiked by Williams. Here comes Hunter the other way, and he is denied. How about, How about the deep hits in both hands? Liddell with the stuff. Pulls up. That one rolls off. Ogilvy rejected by Liddell. <laughs> got to be a steady diet of post-ups of Key and Liddell all game long for Ohio State. Inside, and Liddell with a rejection of Hera. Racing the other way, here's Wheeler. His improved shooting from beyond the arc just makes that high-low even that much more dangerous. This time, though, a blow-by, but Liddell again with another block. His second... Eugene Brown. Y viene a velocidad Tyler Wall, que tiene dos de tres. Tiro hacia un lado y Davis. Y hay falta en la jugada. Davis. Wall. Solito. Davis y tapón. Primera uh. aparición defensiva. De no State. Thrown away there by Branham. Greer. Williams. And he lost it going up. Yeah, second or third possession on North. Drag, you have to stay with the shooter. Got away with it. Yeah, they dodged a bullet. Now Barron going to work, and Liddell rejects it. Second in the conference in that category. Transfer. Oh, Liddell, careless. Barry with another steal. Liddell chasing, and he got to him. They say it's a clean block. So now... New. Again, they scored 51 in the entire game in the loss at Indiana. They already have 45, and Liddell has Ohio State's sixth block of the first half. Johnson blocked by Barron. Outlet, Barry. Oh, nice pass. He left it for Audige. I think it was a pass, right? Good wrap on that left wrist. It was his non-shooting wrist. He knows how to play. Bring some energy. Nice. Pinned off the glass by Liddell. Uh, big time reaction. They double him up. They swing it around. Nice entry again. Feeds. Thompson. No foul. Thompson regains and stripped again. Read about getting back to Liddell. Able to get downhill and you know, at that six foot five frame, he can rise up. Liddell. Not tonight, McGowan's. Another block for E.J. Liddell. And no. Got his own rebound. Wilcher looking for help. There's May and flying it. Blocked by E.J. Liddell. Shows a lot of trust yeah. in Colby Webster, C.J. Wilcher. McGowan goes to the rack. Another block just for good measure for E.J. Liddell. He's third of the game. And Josh Gosser played more of the two. He started as a freshman, but not so much the point. Now Davis and no attack. Wheeler and then from behind comes Liddell. It'll stay with Wisconsin. That's a play. E.J. Liddell with the chase down block. Brad Davison thinks he's got a bucket. E.J. Liddell says, you absolutely do not. And Key challenging that shot. And last touch by Wisconsin. <laughs> Hold it. Third it back for Timberlake. Possession. Timberlake's blocked inside by Liddell. In that mold, hard nose, come to play. Ready to battle. Look at him, one on four. Still battling. He was all by himself again. And out of the break, first shot missed by the Buckeyes. Good pass down low, and from behind the block, Jump ball. That's, that shows the amazing timing. Give it to him. He's open. Liddell with two fouls. Down the air and he blocked Ben Carroll. And here comes Ohio State. Good defense. I think when he eliminates some of the extra dribbles he has and just becomes more of a power player than a finesse one, he'll be even better. Shot blocked by Roach and here comes Ohio State. Two on one. Arns three. Floor. For E.J. Liddell. Yeah, Jones giving up inches at the other end. Driving inside, wraparound pass. Oh, no whistle. They say the defense was good by Look at this hustle. How about that from McKissie? And Michi Johnson this time short. Must not the end of the game. Yeah, got to wait, right? Nice blow by. McKissie. Whoa, Liddell. Big time. <laughs>
<laughs> delivery. AJ, oh. yeah, Cal Young's only 6'8. Got Big Castleton at 6'11. McKissick. He's okay, huh? And, well, it was off the backboard, but rejected still by Liddell. Fleming driving inside. And who's there to pick up? How about Castleton? Yeah. He got two tries at it. Jones, he's a three-point shooter, but what? Well, they cut hard. They sure do. They do everything tough. Both of these clubs. Appleby, left hand. Liddell says, no, thank you. Well, there's the All-American. Hands it off. Here's Kadari Richmond, the Syracuse transfer. Tried to give it back to Obiagu. Rejected by Liddell. Don't put it on the ground. L Liddell got him twice. Beautiful. How about that? E.J. Liddell, who had eight blocks against Xavier. And then on the other end. Coming off the bench. Splits. Leans and rejected by Leans and rejected by Liddell. Plenty of time. Oh, rush. Almost got the bounce. State in Ohio State with the victories over Akron and Niagara, and then Bowling Green on Monday to get to 3-0. Right inside, miss slam. Pretty give by Nunji. Oh, is that what he's doing? I wasn't aware of that. <laughs> <laughs> they the man. That one blocked. They wanted goaltending, but they say the block is clean. First three games and already seven. Uh, they miss Walker, no question about it. I think Chris Washington as well. That one good job by Lawrence. But he chose to go to Ohio State. Well, I thought Orange could have stepped in for Young. It was Young, I think, pick up the charge. How about another block for... And this one taken away again. Outlet. And rejection. Third block for Liddell. How about that kid not giving up on the play? Confident players. He's back on the floor here. Nungie misses there. Yeah, all eight Musketeers who have played have scored in this game, speaking to that depth. And Liddell heating up. He's now in double figures. Ohio State on a run. Xavier hasn't scored in two and a half minutes. And look at the Liddell. Seven block of the game. For and back to man. Yeah, they get out of that zone. Yeah. This lead has been between 5 and 11 points for the last 10 minutes. Rejection That's inside. As well. Thomason got tied up. Ball fake up top. Iorio needed some help. Hammond had it blocked. I'm not sure if it was Branham or Liddell or both, but somebody. As the 6'11", 210-pound Tuba Traore checks in at the post. That was partially deflected. Back to Roberts, off the front of the rim. Players in the country now mismatch between Arroyo and Arns. Roberts drives to the bucket. E.J. Liddell sends it away. Scarlet and Gray racing up the floor. Wheeler in. So as soon as the game's over, stick with us. You get to hear from the Buckeye superstar. E.J. blocks it off the backboard. Iorio kept possession for Niagara. Well, in the half court, that gives you confidence. And then this is a field jumper. You feel that you have opportunities in transition. You just execute it well. If you get a good look and that transition three goes, trouble halfway through the shot clock. Opening night. Clark, his shot is blocked into next Tuesday. And actually, that third score for the Buckeyes. And can Penn State shut down the other guys? Late shot clock, here is Pickett, who had the big game last night, but he put up E.J. Liddell. A little disrespect. E.J. Liddell. <laughs> Sessoms over Liddell, got it. And boy, they're up battling and getting the rebound. Lundy, nobody stops him. He says, I'll take it, but short. 42% three-point shooter. He was above 40% in his last stop at Louisiana as well. Lundy can't connect from deep. Shot fake, dread, this would tie it. Yes, 53 all. Keep in mind here, Penn State has never had the lead tonight. That could change right here. Seth Lundy, there it is. Oh, what a I jump hook. Wheeler, he's been on fire. The most concerned with it's E.J. Liddell and Malachi Branham, six points between the two so far. 
That three up and no run. Marble. Hall, oh, another three. That one's off. Get it. And then on the scramble, Jabari Wheeler just goes right down the lane. That, that's a backbreaker in terms of a possession. Here's Hauser for three. It to not shoot the basketball like they have this season. And I think expected a little bit more offense like they had against Penn State. This guy is a guy. Nebraska with a four-point lead here. This time a step back NBA three. And it didn't ram. Instead, they go on top. Reese, green, three, no. Time. And again, they've been able to drive the ball, get to the free throw line. 20 point performance rush. Oh, wow. Three. That's off. Michi Johnson off the bench. Handle and plumber right now. Goody, two to shoot, has to launch, and it pinballs out to Yuck. E.J. Liddell thought it was off of his opponent, but the official. In the corner now, after the double comes, they'll try the three and quiet right now as Goody tries the baseline drive. Hawkins, step back three, short to Wheeler. Did you get some stops? You feel good about yourself. Now offensively, you're going to get some good looks. But it has to begin to me, making smart plays offensively, but having more energy. See, right. Dumps it to Coburn. Coburn in some trouble. Grandison. That scramble three won't go. Some kind of run late in this season. Third straight game, 20 plus points. 23 tonight. Grandison, deeper for the Illini to get back into this one. That hill, difficult to climb. Plummer, trying to get it done. Grandison will launch from three. Off. A matter of playing two to three games consistently where the ball is going in and you feel good about your shot. And speaking of feet, on and off the floor. And Ohio, Mr. Basketball, runner-up. Back in the day, and there's Miller Kopp. He continues to have a re... Jackson Davis, one-hand pass out to Cop in the corner. Off the heel, Brown with a rebound. Indiana, not a great three-point shooting team, and they've hit six of 16 tonight. Parker Stewart giving it off to Cop. Cop curling and missing. Push off. Gotcha. New shot clock. Patty Mack inside, picked it up in no man's land. Murray D, deflect. Murray bouncing, guarded by Arns. And that jump shot goes. Toussaint thought about it. Murray off the heel. Marines are on the outside looking in, according to the experts. Murray trying to feed Murray on the post, knocked away by Young Bohannon. Pure. You knew he was due. Ready to take a look at the end. I think on that reach down with Wheeler got a piece of it. Bohannon. No. Murray has got to get going offensively. At 20 in the first half. Here's his brother. And talks about the Big Ten and their depth. Bohannon. Top of the arc. Chris Murray. In and out up as he developed in this league, and he certainly has. Well, he's too big for a perimeter player to guard him. He can take him down low. He's too mobile and versatile for a post player. He can take him out. Chris Holtman put Malachi Branham on the back side of that double team. Get him some looks. Wheeler thought he was going to get one. Lowy in the corner, drifting out for a three, and that's what Luke. That double. Sutherland. Baseline pass to battle in the corner. That three rebounded by Arns. Arns got away. I out individuals out there. If you trust them to not go out and get their third foul, and sometimes you got to save guys from themselves, but these coaches put a lot of trust in these guys' hands. Half and a four point lead. Baker, he'll fake. Harper, he'll launch. Have a double tough time getting quality shots here. Defense has been suffocating from Ohio State. Hart lines it up. Off the rim, no. Just about four minutes gone by in this second half. Russell swing. Scott the jump shot. Got a tough kid too. Not the shooter of his brother, but mm -hmm. very competitive. 
been injured in that Big Ten tournament, miraculously recovered. Open look, Scott. A late double. Edie, a mountain of a man, good interior defense. Key was there. They work it into the corner. That's a three. And he last eight from three, the last five games, but lined that one up and knocked it down. 20 to seven, offensive woes continue. I get that, but he's really good friends with a lot of these guys. Still talks to his old roommate, Hera, pretty much every day. Sessoms, another one of his bones back. I, I think he's going to play more. That's for sure. Have to, right? Sessoms fighting Lee. Lee with one to shoot has it rejected. Like again, Penn State entering a little bit of dangerous territory. Pickett got the seal off from Hare and he laid it in. Clock. Cross court skip. Cornwall misses and a put back for Greg Lee. Greg Lee. Sessoms inside out Cornwall in the lane got it up and in his first get to the quarterfinals on the line to face Purdue tomorrow night Hera up Hera blocking foul on Brown spinning against his former teammate Wheeler off the mark there's Hera Hera puts it back home some soreness and evidently right there Zed Key may have come down on it and re-injured it a little bit Jones turns the corner right. Jones crossover dribble. Euro step left it off the glass and it's coming back. Just get that left hand out in the passing lane. Hogarth drives the baseline. Hey, and use the left hand. To tell the guys about it anymore. Hopefully the things that they instinctually learn on their own. Under three. Walker kick. Aiken drives the base. Uh, difficult. I mean, like EJ Liddell can just hit difficult shots. He finds a way to put the ball in the bucket. Fourth in the league in scoring, and he can also block. Jumper. Verge right down the pipe, but it's knocked out of bounds and off of Verge. Aggressive to the rim. And it's a guy playing in his 153rd game tonight in college. What a block by Liddell. McGowan blows by Orange and puts it in as he's fouled. Birch will go to the line, drawing the contact here. Verge doesn't get the bounce. It's star, 24 points tonight. Drives inside, missed it. In right now to Dante Scott. Shot clock at three. Russell will fly down that lane. Wow. Rebound for out inside by Ian Martinez. He is from Costa Rica. That's not nine three-point attempts by a state. So he collects himself, makes sure he knows where all the defenders are, and then with that little fadeaway jump shot. I don't know how you guard that. I know. Sticks with it. And went last nine points. Got the high screen. Works now into Wheeler. That's four shots. Came off the bench and got the Terrapins up by two. Or got the Buckeyes up by two. Iowa inside. To the table. Unfortunately, he had the surgery he had to have, but he'll be ready to play. Goldberg with the Joe Hook. Over Zed up and it's his back. Look at all the Buckeyes around Kofi Coburn. Somehow keeps the basketball in his hand. And then the tip jam. With 15 to shoot. Where do you think that rock is going? <laughs> Down to Kobe Coburn. Are you kidding? He was shooting like 36, 37 percent. That's how good defensively they are. For Bello, short on that runner and the rebound in his hands to make a play. Plummer right Bravo. into Liddell. That's a travel. Really good defense. First by Jamari Wheeler. He's lob inside to Coburn. Working around Young and Liddell. Liddell got a piece of that one with a rejection and saved by... Got a body off of Young who was able to tip it in. Coburn inside and Liddell there to clean it up again. He talked about how he... Here's Hawkins. Liddell scoring in and a foul. Play with the Clippers. We were golf, cigars. I mean, one of my favorite older mature gentleman and it was at Penn State when the game really did slow down and he was able to see it a lot more to an excellent drive by Xavier Johnson
and Jim Liddell. Now that time, Parker did slip, but again, it was because he was going to play hard up top to kind of deny the pass. And at least have DJ Liddell just kind of put his eyes on him. Xavier Johnson, yeah. pretty move using the pivot for it. Out to Bates, trying to get it into Thompson. He cannot. Three to shoot. Johnson, great pass, and with one second to spare. Daniels plowing down the lane. And Samuels making a move on Liddell. Shot clock at seven. It's Moore against Young, weaving his way inside. Now they've got Slater. Liddell, rebound. Gillespie has the mismatch. Dances on key to the rack. Rejected by Liddell. Picked Norris will work around with Wheeler on him, contorting and feeding to Kennedy with a floater on the floor. And the other way. Working his way in. It's just hard for a holder to get any openings. Well, who can create for their own? Hall oh, driving inside. Rebound. I think he's going to play more. That's for sure. Too, right? Sessoms fighting Lee. Lee with one to shoot has it rejected. Uh, Sessoms wants a high screen to go. Two to shoot. Drives inside. And that will be the tournament. Diabate, great catch. Seven to shoot. Top of the key. Jones backs it up. Three to go. Jones, Euro up and in. Ten on the shot clock. Hauser. And he dropped it. Trying to put the shoulder. Hall. Hangs and draws the foul. To tell the guys about it anymore. Hopefully the things that they instinctually learn on their own. Under three. Walker. Difficult. I mean, like DJ Liddell can just hit difficult shots. He finds a way to put the ball in the bucket. Fourth in the league in scoring, and he can also block it. And it's a Nebraska team that's playing with a lot of confidence on the offensive end of the floor. Certainly feeling pretty good about the way that they have played, and particularly that win at Penn State. Good hands by Liddell. Peripheral vision obstructed a little bit. He has told us how much he hated wearing that mask. He knew why he had to wear it. Burge comes to get it. Drives on Liddell. Good defense. That's four shots. Came off the bench and got the Terrapins up by two. Or got the Buckeyes up by two. Ayala inside. Trying to be a three-point shooter because that's not his game yet. Anderson on the attack. And he's blocked inside by Liddell. Really in there without Trey Galloway, Rob Fennessy, and Christian Lander tonight. All injured. Race Thompson, no, put back, missed that to Davis, double team. He'll try again. That spin moving in the block by Young. Jackson Davis had it straight. Terrific in the mid-range game. Well, you think about it, in high school, he played the four position, and there is Murray putting pressure the other way. Chris Murray. McCaffrey in the hole, tried to jam it, rejected again. Get his tail off down there. 10 points on a 4 or 5 shooting. Chris Murray blocked again. Guys to reverse pivot spin and then use the bounce to get to the lane. Chris Murray. And look at the number of games. Right there. Is that that? No, that's the number of games. But the 427, JJ Reddick. Murray cut off. Arns. Under 4 to play. To suck. Explodes to the basket. And lose game in the Big Ten. They gave up a home. As Gohan and it's the flip before the timeout. So Minnesota down 13. Trying to find a way back in this one. This guy's going to have to lead the way. Willis inside with Key and Liddell crushed. Didn't get Key a touch on that trip, though. Now baseline drive and a bump by Liddell. His third person. There is Brooks. Brent Johns. He you know, Brooks is coming off, and Johns just didn't screen for him. Jones oh, wow. swatted away, and then... And now Arns is on the floor for the first time. Harper baseline, challenged by Key, knocked out of bounds. Ohio State... 
Okay, he draws two. Harper off the fake. He'll drive against Key. No. And break. Ohio State up 30 to 16. Block on the inside, Liddell, and a foul is called as Liddell and Scott. Russell, swing for Scott, two-man game, 13 to shoot. They overload one side, let them dribble Jaren. I will fix that. <laughs> Still counts. The drive, no good. Especially as you get Corbello, Kofi Coburn back. Sutherland, the drive, no good. Fall, do you get that call? I think it's probably not. There's battle. There he is. Lincoln is. Felt himself that space to go up and make shots. Just has a knack for doing so. On the drive, Say misses the runner. Shooting from beyond the arc just makes that high low even that much more dangerous. This time though, a blow by, but Liddell again with El no pudo y ahora contra jugada de Tyler Wall. Jugada personal y tranquilamente 7 a Chile y el tercero de la nación que por cierto ya le quitaron lo invicto a Baylor. Esto terminando nuestro compromiso. Wall. Solito de visita Pon. Opportunity here for the Cats. Robbie Barron, he's had a quiet night. Cannot get the bounce. Time Northwestern chips it to single digits. Ohio State has an answer as their Boo Booey attacks fearlessly and draws the foul. Wrist, it was his non shooting wrist. He knows how to play, bring some energy. Oh, nice hand off the. CJ Wilcher giving it up to Verge. Verge on the take. And then Joey Brunk, who's feeling it. Does Nebraska want to alter some of their coverages defensively? Walker put his shoulder right into Liddell. Strong play, able to get downhill. And you know, at that six foot five frame, he can rise up. Liddell, not tonight, Miguel. He hurt his ankle the other day as well. Five seconds left in the half. Para powers it up. Missed it. Comes back to him at the hole. Diabate and Liddell, what a great matchup. Diabate, the youngster, trying to fake. Joey Hauser, transfer from Marquette, using that left hand and lays it in. Now all of a sudden, it's going to be covering each other, Liddell. Marble asking for it, working on Liddell, the jump hook, and it rolls in. And I Kyle Young, so, boy, things are unraveling in an interesting fashion here tonight on March 1st. Fade away for Wiltshire. In college basketball games, these players on the floor have played here for Maryland. A lot. Oh, oh look at him. Oh, take it in. Sneaking in. Lob inside to Coburn. Working around Young and Liddell. Liddell got a piece of that one with a rejection and saved by... Got a body off of Young who was able to tip it in. Coburn inside and Liddell there to clean it up again. You talked about how he... But again, okay. he was in the mix of that. There we go. So I, didn't, I didn't catch that back in with the players. And it's always a tough situation, and we're going to let that one ride a little bit in Judah, but he just hasn't found the stroke this season. Well, a lot of times you think it's transferable. See a beautiful move, a tough move inside. Jackson Davis. Ooh. Ooh, violent spin move, and then a foul on Liddell. Inside, Thompson. With Liddell on his hip, up with the left hand, no good. Battle for the rebound, and we got a thing had to do as far as their game plan. Ohio State led by as many as 11. Mm -mm, bad pass. And a good job to fit Trace Jackson Davis. He's been quiet the last 10 minutes or so. Left hand hook. Off the heel. And put it on the floor there. All those guards are there. Shoot that thing or get it out the backside. And Curry against Liddell. An offensive foul on Curry. His first. Michigan is making a concerted effort to pound this thing inside and let their bigs go to work. Diabate. So, not just from an effort and, and mobility standpoint, but from an IQ standpoint, too. I mean, that was going to be a wide open shot. Oh. Get the... Here is Caleb Houston, who's got two only this game, and that was an errant entry feed from Brooks to Diabate. Oh, my, my question is I thought Caleb Houston could have shot that. Could have got to the other side, maybe gone reverse layup.
Diabate did not. With it. It's probably not fair. So I'm asking him to do a lot of other stuff too. This is Dickinson. Carrier. It's Diabate. Got the whistle. This zone into man is really stagnated. Hunter Dickinson guarded that like he was the middleman in the 2 3 zone. Trying to spin up. You made the reservation. You didn't pay for us. Oh, walk, I think, yeah. It is a travel. And that's Liddell's aggressive. State que lleva en el balón adentro, en gran parte porque hacen las pantallas en lo alto de la de la llave. Qué bien, se volteó. Wall se va a dar la vuelta y le cometen falta. No, caminó. Stay with the shooter. Got away with it. Yeah, they dodged a bullet. Now Barron going to work, and Liddell rejects it. Coach. Now he watches Pete Nance, his leader, go to work and draw the foul. Plays aggressively at the offensive end, but that was a big time hesitation. Nance on There the other go. side. Well, it's two great veterans going against each other. They double him up. They swing it around. Nice entry again. Feeds. Tops in. No foul. Not settled in. Thompson. With the right hand. Stewart shot clock. With just second remaining and Geronimo foul. Oh. Backing his way down, stripped away. Good defense there from Liddell. AJ Liddell just came down and took that ball from Stephen Crowell. Here's Hepburn got around Wheeler. Now Carlson. Tough shot off the mark. With the chase down block, Brad Davison thinks he's got a bucket. EJ Liddell says, you absolutely do not. They get it inside. This is Thompson. On the hook. Out in the passing lane. You got to make a pass fake first. Buckeyes have five turnovers early. John going to work there. Pretty play over Liddell with the... He's just a, a unique player. Just a big time shot blocker. Bancaro looking for points one and two. That's too strong. He's been a little... Liddell with two fouls. Down the air and he blocked Bancaro. Jones. And no touches down here for Kessler. Good footwork. What a battle this should be. Castleton patient, and he wins the saddle drill. Inside, losing his footing, and lost it out of bounds. Xavier turnover going against. Ohio State, one of the ranked Big Ten teams, sitting number 19 this week in the country. Off the mark that time for play. Uh, Sessoms wants a high screen to go. Two to shoot. Drives inside, and that will be some soreness and evidently right there. Zed Key and have come down on it and re-injured it a little bit. Jones turns the corner, right points a nine rebound. Here come the fans now. Inside the Abate! What a look! Give with two timeouts, Ohio State with one. Jones backing his way down. Inside the Abate! Over 13,000 strong. Hoiberg's mm. crew. Andre inside puts it up with a left hand. It's a Nebraska team that's playing with a lot of confidence on the offensive end of the floor. Certainly feeling pretty good about the way that they have played, and particularly that win at Penn State. Good hands by the peripheral vision obstructed a little bit. He has told us how much he hated wearing that mask. He knew why he had to wear it. Nebraska with a four-point lead here. This time a step back NBA three. And it's four shots. Came off the bench and got the Terrapins up by two. Or got the Buckeyes up by two. Ayala inside. 15-foot jump shot. Buckeyes up three, dropping off the pass. Xavier Johnson and Jackson Davis gets bumped on his way up as we go back. There is Brooks. Brandon Johns. He like Brooks is coming off, and Johns just didn't screen for him. Jones oh, wow. slotted away and then really sticking with Baker, giving him no room. And now guarded by Kia Mori down low. 
Five to shoot Mulcahy against Waddell. Bounce pass in traffic and a turnover. Tonight with 23. It's been terrific in ball screen action. Draws two. Amore dunks it down and we're even. Ohio State up 30 to 16. Block on the inside. Liddell and a foul is called as Liddell and Scott. He forced him to put it on the deck. Now they got what they wanted. That's you got to know who's inside. Russell, bullseye. So much for them. One of those guys does an awful lot of things. Shoots at 37. Look at this pull up. Ivy taking contact. Two, minutes. Uh, two well, well coached teams. No question about it. And talented. Nice pass. Beautiful, beautiful bounce. Ivy setting the table as well. Russell, the guy that they essentially brought over to replace Dwayne Washington as their shooting guard. Look at this. The lead score last year. Ivy a little bit short. Rebound. Steady diet of post ups of Key and Liddell all game long for Ohio State. Inside. Oh. And Liddell with a rejection. Of so nice to see him playing at this level this early. He's got 8 of 10 so far for Ohio State. Audige hits from the elbow. Him. Trying to get his legs underneath him as well. Inside look to Walker. This pull up and again that that, that thing's going to be back. That mid range jumper's going to be there. Davis over Liddell. How about the two guys? Not caught that right because he he doesn't fire blanks like that normally. Usually he's open. He's letting it fly. Now you mentioned Liddell's a guard a little bit better. Shoot a little bit better on the perimeter and that shot right there, Mark, certainly helps the cause if he can keep that up throughout the season. It's Ohio. Too strong on the drive. The defense that Penn State played last year where they amassed a lot of steals, but they left open opportunities that get their biggest <laughs> Man, college athlete. Feels like Kyle Young's been at Ohio State for a long, long time. Right through the hands of Jelani in January. Pretty good litmus test to see where your club is before you go into the holidays. EJ Liddell picked the pocket of uncharacteristic of the key. He usually doesn't put it on the floor in a crowd. Lundy going to the long tail, no whistle, out of bounds, going to Ohio State. Moments ago, we saw Hera and Wheeler. Wheeler. Duke has to see a lot of red bodies in this game, can't just be one on one. Lefty rolls, he had great spin on it, Jeremy Roach. Dominates some of the extra dribbles he has and just becomes more of a power player than a finesse one. He'll be even better. Shot blocked by Roach, and here comes Ohio. Drank, but it was vastly <laughs> different. <laughs> Alley oop, good pass. Bancaro found Williams. Really good. 6 8. That big castle said it's 6 11. McKissick. He's okay, huh? And well, it was off. Here's Kadari Richmond, the Syracuse transfer. Tried to give it back to Obiagu. Rejected by Liddell. Don't put it on the ground. The season, despite coming off the bench. Splits. Leans and rejected by Liddell. Plenty of time. Oh, rush. Start here for the Buckeyes. Bowling Green looking for their first points. 0 for 2 here from the floor. There's an opportunity. Thomason got tied up. Ball fake up top. Iorio needed some help. Hammond had it blocked. A couple of one and dones for the Buckeyes here recently. Hammond, good handles. And then got rejected this weekend. Just excellent that Phillips able to come here to Ohio State, experience what game days like for basketball and football, and have a great weekend. Hope you enjoy. It's going to be an entertaining game. <laughs> Ali Ali steps back. Indiana not a great three-point shooting team, and they've hit six of sixteen tonight. Parker Stewart giving it off to Cobb. Cobb curling and missing. Push off. Murray bouncing, guarded by Arns. And that jump shot goes. Reams are on the outside looking in, according to the experts. Murray. Get away. Chris Murray. McCaffrey to the hole. Trying to jam it with Jackson again. early in that one as well. So there'll be a lot of changes near the top tonight. Battle. Short on that shot before the timeout. So Minnesota down 13. Trying to find a way back in this one. This guy's going to have to lead the way. Willis inside with Key and Liddell. Length to contest. 
He really got space, though. That, that was an impressive fadeaway jumper by E.J. Liddell. He has a phenomenal array of moves. He's got moves. And now Arns is on the floor for the first time. Harper baseline challenged by Key, knocked out of bounds. Ohio State by scissor to a double. Eric Hunter, not a killist. That's a three oh. off to the right. Three of it. They will fix that. <laughs> Still counts. The drive. No good. I'll get it. As a defense, you got to deter guys from trying to even get offensive rebounds by, by not even thinking about it. Check them out. You still got something to prove. I like that. You know, give, give me, give me 35 to 75. Felt <laughs> himself that space to go up and make shots. Just has a knack for doing so. Not one post scorer as Zed Key, but he stretches the defense more as an improved perimeter shooter. Wide open underneath. Kept burn. Wall. He went there healthy. He just hasn't had his legs, but if you're Northwestern, you better come out in this four-minute stretch and not let him get a shot off. Well, good set play to get Pete in. It's going to be really interesting to watch the first four minutes of this ball game. Yeah, Chris Holtman said he felt like he was worried that his team was maybe going to be a little anxious, too. When Cy McGowan's couldn't hell, able to get downhill, and at you know, that six-foot-five frame, he can rise up. Liddell, not tonight, McGowan. All his shots have come from the three-point arc. Two of five from the outside. Holden again. Does Great it again. Three. Good three-point shooter. Shoots 90% from the free-throw line. You know, just under 10 points, six rebounds. I mean, he's just a guy you can rely on. Say. But, you know, oftentimes fans forget these guys aren't robots with numbers on their back. These guys are real human beings. Yeah, I feel sorry for the fans who have to wait several weeks before he gets on the way full steam. Comes in, sub for him on a consistent basis. Nice curl. Deruji fading and won't get the bounce. And Castleton and Fleming have been the guys tonight, Ralph. I would go quickly so you get another opportunity. Get a little two for one. And Liddell heating up. He's now in double figures. Ohio State on a run. Xavier hasn't scored two and a half minutes. Gathered it back in. Purple Eagles in the corner. Iorio wants to launch. Off the heel of the rim and Key clears it. Yeah, Scotty Pippen Jr. really struggling to get his offense going in this game. He's one for five from the field and he's had a little bit of trouble trying to get past. Uh, and his teammates have a tremendous amount of confidence in him to get it back to him after he had to give it up off the double. 23 for Liddell, the dream. Back door. Power dribble, good block by Liddell. He just loves the game, appreciates how much Larry Brown has actually taught him. He saw the numbers in the Big Ten, of course, a share of the Big And here's the man, Lundy. That time, no. Big rebound. Fell of Illinois. And a turnover by Purdue. Dream. Yeah, E.J. Liddell is such a unique uh, talent with his long wingspan. He can do a lot of different things. 23 points for Dwayne Washington. Nance hits his second. Range jumper. Take a step in. Knock it down. Here's Cop. A rare miss. Expect Baker to get this shot. Oh, if he would have gotten a good pass, he would have gotten it all. Able to get it up. A guy career, but CJ. Florida State transfer back into the starting five of the Buckeyes. Juzang. That's two. Jewel Bernard. Tuesday. States played only five games before the season started. They said you're going to have to play at least six if you're going to get in the Big Ten title game. The long three's in. Liddell leads all scorers with 14.
Or he wasn't moving as he was when he was playing so well the last few weeks. Nance, set play for him. No, good look, though. I'm pretty for a guy here. You, you got to love that name, Danny Hall. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you got to come in and start doing something. <laughs> what a block at the rim by E. But late in the game, she's been very good. All right, so now the Terps may be starting to settle into this game a little bit. Three-point lead for the Pimps. Each team with two free throw attempts so far. Get up, get up. Stopping and popping Gable. Mid Ohio State. But Ohio State has been too loose with the ball. They have turned it over. Very deep team this year, expected to weather the storm of a 20-game Big Ten schedule much more effectively than they did last year when they went eight. In today's college basketball, it's rare that you see an offense run through a post guy, a post touch. And Wesson's that guy. Wesson's that guy.